Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew. Welcome to Wednesday. Look who's back. Hey, guys. It's, uh, it's Carolyn. Dude, it's been like three weeks or two weeks. At least or, two. I told James it feels like I haven't been back in a year. So much happens <laughs> like if, every week for me that like, yeah, I feel like I haven't seen you guys in a year, but... It's good to be back. It's so good to be back. So welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, where we play new games on classic consoles at 60 frames a second. So Very if you're not key. watching at 60 frames a second, click little buttons down at the bottom and make sure you are because these video games rely on you being at 60 frames especially a if you're on youtube man it's because yes. youtube is not going to default that you got to kind of set it yeah it depends if you're a, uh, oh thank you for the sound oh my god it's always something isn't it it's always something they need, they need to fix that one of these years maybe they will yeah um so we're in back in sync now that's perfect. There oh, we, we go. got Carl G. Hey, dude, and Andrew Davy, and um, so yeah, let's welcome the people in the chat. We've got Frost. Carl G. Repentless VG, Andrew Davy, whose game we're gonna be playing oh, today. Uh, we also have Splendid Nut, whose game we're gonna be playing today. Uh, <laughs> Muddy Monster. Funster, whose game we're gonna be playing today. For us, it's the day. I'm sure for you, it's the evening, though. That's right. This is the it cool thing about depends. streaming. It's like anywhere in the world. I think for Andrew Davy, it's like the middle of the night. Wow, thanks or for... early, early morning, you can... Yeah, man, let type, us know. Type the time in, because he's in... I'm going to mess it up again. New Zealand? I think it was New Zealand. Yeah, so. Uh, I hope so. And we've got uh, Thomas, Thrust 26. Did I say Ground Trooper? 4 a.m. 4 a.m., There dude, we go. We've got for... Ice Posta here. That's technically the middle of the night and the morning. <laughs> it's Depen both. Depending on when you go to bed and when you get up. <laughs> yeah. And how much you party and... It's, it's borderline, because 3 a.m. is like... That's not the morning, but 4 a.m. maybe. There's people Australia, who get up at 4 a.m. Australia, got it wrong. Oh, shit. We said New Zealand last time, <laughs> yeah. and you were like, yo. Yo, no. Not no. Aussie. Okay. Uh, we got some games, four games we're going to be playing today. Oh, cool. And they're all updates. So I thought we'd do a catch-up episode on some games we've played before. Some you may have not played before. It's very possible. I only play like 50% of the show. That's so true. It's really, it's pretty good <laughs> odds for me to have seen or not seen something. Yeah. So the games we're going to be playing today, Daredevil uh, by Muddy Funster. I know, Andrew, it is. I know it's terrible. We're we fucking know, assholes. <laughs> we'll get it right. We know, know that association. That's the perfect, it is. It's the perfect analogy. <laughs> it is exactly that same thing. Um, we've got Chaotic Grill by uh, Philip Blackman, a.k.a. Splendid Nut. Mm -hmm. We've got Sokobu uh, by Andrew Davey. Oh. Uh, we've got Dragon's Descent by Revan Tooley. I just superficially, that poster has hooked me of the, the Dragon's, Dragon's Descent. Descent. So I don't think you've played Dragon's Descent. No, I haven't. So it is, it's got some RPG elements. It's definitely got maze elements. Fuck yeah. And we're going to have to draw some maps. So I'm um, in, man. And because I do want to get really far in that game. Because last time, I didn't draw maps. And you have to kind of find your way through things. And it gets hard when you have to keep battling monsters as and you memorize memorizing. things yeah oh god okay we'll nail it yeah. it's just a cool like i like them it's like this mask of some kind it looks like yeah. a gas mask it's sort of it's satanic great. it's like I, a, a bull it's i'm a bull's mask. into that yeah. design yeah his is the design of the levels that he has in his game is is really good um i want to th thank the twitch subscribers um of which it keeps growing it's Whoa. wonderful thank you so much everyone charles and check ground trooper Johnny WC23, Mr. Fix, Muddy Funster, Nathan Strum, RC70, Repentless VG, Retro Happy Hour, Spastastic, Spartan 581, Spiceware, S. Ramirez 2008, The D Train 37, Tiki Dan K, and Trek MD. That is a lot of names. Yeah. Um, and you can support the show too uh, by subscribing for free. Who does the mock up labels? Yeah. I think that's. Uh, uh, oh, the mock-up, I do those. Yeah, I was going to say. The mock-up ones, not the... Not like, the... Dragon's Descent, is somebody did that. They yeah, did that. but James, whenever there isn't one, he'll do it, which is... Yeah, because some of them are in work in progress. They just came out. Totally. It's not at that stage, so I, ha I need something. And so, you know, I do my best. Yeah. It's not bad. Um, you can support the show for free and subscribe if you have Amazon Prime, and you just link it to your Twitch Prime and click subscribe. And you can uh, help us out and get your name read on the show. Um, we do have a poll question today. Ooh. Sometimes I think of them, and uh, this time it is about Flickr oh, in Atari 2600 games, because that is uh, kind of a hot topic sometimes. 
If you have um, epilepsy, no. but not that kind of flicker. Well, <laughs> sometimes it does get to that point. Yeah, if, uh, that's like you know, it's... M- most of us can take a little flicker. Yeah, but yeah, sometimes it gets out of hand. But here's the. Uh, let's just start it. There we go. Ooh. Four four uh, possibilities. Uh, the first one is no flicker at all. I'm still getting flashbacks from the original 2600 Pac-Man. Yeah, terrible. That was a game that had terrible flicker. Oh, dude, I remember we did the we did the Pac-Man, Pac-Man. one, and yeah. Dan, that was because it was one of the worst. flickering at 15 hertz, which means one. Uh, it draws it one out of four times, so it was like yeah. like this. So every ghost was flickering. So it's really that's like one of the worst examples of yeah. flicker. Pac-Man 2600 is like someone being like, do you want a Coke? And then they <laughs> hand you like an RC Cola that's <laughs> yes. just been sitting in the garage like, for like decades. You're like, oh, I mean, thanks. It's, it's in the same realm. It tastes <laughs> like, oh. <laughs> yeah, and it's warm too. Yeah, it's not, <laughs> it's not refrigerated. Um, number two answer is a minor amount of flickers okay when it's absolutely necessary. Um, answer three is with flicker management and Luma Boost flicker is very acceptable, yeah. which is what a lot of the more advanced games are using right now. Um, and four, the more flicker, the better the graphics. My eyes are ready. Bring it. <laughs> and there are games out there that people just, just go for it. Just, con- well, just yeah. tons and tons of flicker so they can put a lot on the screen, but they aren't really taking into account that it kind of puts it over the edge. Well, yeah. And, and then they don't use any flicker management either. So when they don't need to flicker, I mean, everybody's going to pick three. But what's, it's, oh, it's a good, interesting topic because a lot of the more advanced, uh, not advanced, but a lot of the games that are pushing the limits of what the 2600 can do, um, uh, especially like Champ Games, they uh, he does a lot of ports. From the arcade which involves a ton of sprites yeah so you can't really make these games like ports there's not really a lot of leeway to change them into something else because people go well that's not the game anymore so he has to do a lot of flickering um but he's re- he's got really good flicker management so if there isn't the same character on the same line it won't flicker but as soon as it passes through on the same line he'll flicker it a bit as little as possible and then it, it passes by it it's done the flickering and also he'll do some what's called luma boost because when it's flicker it gets a little dull so he changes the colors and you'd be interested yeah, in this man. um he increases the intensity of the color so that it kind he tries to equal the non flicker color to the flickering color by by changing the color God, like is... increasing the intensity of it and it and it works really really well and you know you try different things like oh that's a little bit off and it's really interesting well, these, this is the coolest thing about this community is these wizards going in and trying oh to kind of use this i'm yeah. starting to sort of see the atari 2600 as this like paintbrush almost you know yes. like now that i've been like deep into the show it's but it's like, an old paint yeah it's analog mm-hmm. and it's yeah. dealing with like this this like these techniques that it's like it's like oil painting almost you know it's like yeah. it's this lost art that's like this different thing that has this texture and character yeah you know but i think one the the answer one is a very valid one for me as yeah. well i would pick one and three uh because let's take um dan kitchen who was an original programmer for Activision. And Activision was very stringent about no flicker at all, ever. Yeah. So you had to build your games around that premise of you make sure that there is not more than one, pl- two players, you know, each of the players on any line whatsoever. And you had to build your screen and your game thinking about that. So there was a lot of layering and if you look yeah. at Activision games, they're they're usually side views, so that at the and you don't go above the top, you don't go below the bottom. So they always had an Activision on the bottom, their sim, their uh, logo and their name. They always had nice sunsets in the top where you never ventured into. Yeah. Right. And then you had a lot of layers of action, vertical layers, so that it looks like there's a lot going on on the screen, which there is. But there's never two things on the same line no never more than two things because that's all you have to play yeah um so 
there's those people who work within those uh, those. So types it's amazing of how like a quality control is totally like just a kind of box that puts people in, and it's interesting yeah. how when you do set these standards of of operation, you end up affecting the design of something. It's like yeah. inevitable. Um, yeah, like if you look at Daredevil, the first one we're going to play, and we can reference this throughout while yeah. we're playing. Um, that is a very vertical game. Um, it's a, a parachute guy going down to Earth. And you're passing through a lot of horizontal um, obstacles. But it's never more than two on the same line. I mean, there's triplicates and a bunch of yeah. tricks you can do. Um, um, and, and, uh, but then you see Chaotic Grill, which is the second game we're going to play, which there's a lot of enemies. And they get to the same line. But he's using those advanced techniques of Luma Boost and 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 Flicker uh, management. Um, but so those are you know two different techniques. But you end up with two different great games. But you have to think about that at the beginning of when you program what type of look you're going for, yeah. what type of game. Um, so Andrew Davy said Thomas and I did a lot of experimenting um, with this when we were um, competing <laughs> on how to display color images and how much Flickr is acceptable. Would love to exactly. hear some of the discoveries you guys made and some of your opinions. Mm -hmm. um, he said later, like I wrote a version in Basic on the Atari. Um, uh, it was lost, but I recently sent oh. some mystery discs to be recovered, <laughs> and lo and behold, Sokoban was one of them. Oh, so it's cool. not referencing what he just said, but I'm, I'd be curious what kind of because obviously you guys would be the people to tell us as well. What what how far did you feel like you could push it oh, in your competition? The Splendid Nut just said he hasn't added Luma Boost yet. Ooh. So that um, definitely ref, uh, go check that out um, because it helps a lot. Because when you know that third character gets on the line, they start they look a little faded or yeah. everything looks faded. And if you just um, there's a lot of discussion in the Atari Age forums about Luma Boost and how that's implemented. Um, and it will help a lot the look of it, but I mean that's that's at the end, yeah. or it's not. It's something you add a little bit later. And and Arena, thanks for joining us on your break. Hey, Arena Foot. Hopefully, you kick around for a while. But we get it, man. You got to go back to work. You got to yeah. go back to work. But thanks for watching us on your break. Yeah, that's welcome. that's very cool. Um, so I'm going to put in three. I th I think I can do one and three. Now. Yeah. So I like I like both both I like the no flicker games where they yeah. they put a lot into the work of it, but I also like the flicker games where they just throw everything at the screen. Let's make it complicated yeah. and great looking as well. Yeah, man, I don't. I think that um, I'd probably go with four. You know? just, <laughs> just go all out. Just, just go I, crazy. I'd rather I'd rather people just go for it and yeah. see what happens. Obviously, though, there is a point where you're like, this is giving me a headache. <laughs> In which case, I think. But I, I wouldn't want to like like how you know you were describing Activision sort of kind of. I wouldn't. They worked within the parameters. Yeah, I don't want to give parameters. I like the <laughs> idea of just pu see how far you can push it, and then yeah. it's like okay, because I I think the cool thing is I want all the things to exist you know right everything yeah like you want to see it all and so if one thing's really if something's really screwed up and there you go there's uh, your there's a solution from andrew <laughs> just blink and synchronization yes that's gonna be my <laughs> technique i used flicker and tire tracks to do the sunset and that worked and created a nice effect yeah. yes it was beautiful man tire like tracks you, is a beautiful game man like it looks so oh, good it's gorgeous and and yeah you can use flicker on purpose it's totally so that you can make ghosts or um uh, a flickering candle or I'm totally or, or fire or a sunset where it's kind of fading out or it's merged with something exactly, else exactly man this is why i don't want to put parameters Trans on people i want to <laughs> and and uh you can use it for transparency or like in aardvark where there was a sun and a cloud and there and they wanted to to simulate transparency so there was a, a flicker, flicker effect oh, flicker effect where one they would um, change the priority of each of the uh, layers, and it was unbelievable. Aaron likes Pac Man. I love, <laughs> I love the troll. And uh, yeah. you're trying to like, you know, find the logic in my argument That's and right. take me down. Therefore, therefore, Aaron likes Pac Man. I'm happy that Pac Man exists. <laughs> That's right. But do I, do I, do I like it? Oh. Yeah. As I said, it's a warm RC cola, man. When you promised a Coke. Oh yeah. So I'm wearing. Um, an Atari Age t-shirt. I usually don't wear this one. Oh, yeah. Because it's not very interesting on the front. But I love the back of it. Oh, yeah. So I'll show you the back, but you won't... Let's see if I can... Oh, well, Is this the right? Yeah, yeah. That's perfect. 
Good games only need one red button. Fuck yeah, man. Oh, yeah. It's true. And, uh, yeah, it's amazing what these uh, programmers can get out of one button games. You can get multiple options. You can play RPGs yeah. with just one button. It's, it's unbelievable crazy. what what has been accomplished with this one simple red button on the original joystick. I'm going to use different joysticks with don't, with don't have red buttons. Um, the original Wizard of War is unplayable for me. Yeah. It's yeah. pretty flickery as well, and well, that's I'm, why it's been remade by totally. Champ Games, and, and it's, it's a great success. It's really cool. Um, like, like I think gameplay probably is number one for Always. me. Like, if I love Always. the gameplay, I'll overlook a lot. But I yeah, mean, so if the gameplay, like, if there's flicker, but the gameplay is unbelievable, you can maybe forgive the flicker. Totally. Sometimes. Yeah. All, but it, I'm sure I will certainly say that there's points where it's like, okay, that's just a mistake. And we gotta <laughs> fix this, boys. Yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 it could be better. Let's make it better. Or okay. girls, sorry. Yeah. I don't, I don't want to gender it. <laughs> not many. Um, not many women programmers we need in more. the homebrew realm. Um, think of, I can, I think I only have ever talked about two wow. before yeah so it's it's that's too bad we need it's, more we do need more so it's possible we there's some incognito that could be true you I, can be anybody you want on the internet yeah and name yourself anything you want so because my and sometimes that happens my, to to avoid you know trouble conflict i got a, a drama super quick story yeah I, I mentioned on the show my fucking roommate's mother was getting trolled on the internet my sister was right. around and i told her the story about it and when she said to me she was like oh erlin like <laughs> no, rule number one if you're a female gamer you do not let anybody know that you're a girl because you will you will it'll, it'll change and i've heard yeah. this from so many dynamics I've, will change totally online games women pretend to be men yeah. a lot of the time because you'll get treated badly you'll get and weirdly because yeah. it is a, and so it's like so it's very possible that there's some programmers yeah. who are, you know, because it's it is this the dirtiest secret of internet gaming when it comes to women is this you it's really hard. And I bet uh, one uh, games with voice chat where you have to have voice chat they just completely avoid it, absolutely um, or get a vo vocoder yeah <laughs> a voice and, changer you could do that. And they uh, one yeah. of my friends also is a female gamer. She told me she'll only play games where people know her gender if she personally knows them. Right. She's yeah. like and she told so many crazy stories. Of like getting dick pics and all mm. kinds of gross things and she's like why am i getting treated this way when like literally if yeah. i just called myself tom everyone i could just have fun playing this game right yeah um so it's it is one of those things where it's 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 tough it is being it's in the tough. wild west and i hope it gets better i really do too and it will it will it just you know the idiots have to just go away well yeah or fix themselves uh, okay Let's get into the games, and we'll check out the poll uh, results after the first game. Yeah. Because then it'll be closed there. Um, Gamergate. Gamergate. Let's not get into it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Good choice, James. I'm always down to jump into it, but I think it's. I think we're gonna keep the show rolling too. Exactly. We, are, we got a, We got a big intro. So let's hold down the second button. And oh. Boot up, Daredevil. Dude, I'm in. Is this related to the uh, the oh, Daredevil yeah. like comic? Uh, the superhero? Not at all. No. Uh, oh, I'll switch over for you. Okay, cool. It's always so trippy because on stream there's a slight delay. <laughs> so, like, if I'm trying to do something, I'll hit it and it'll be like... Yeah. It's, it's, a, it's a nightmare. Now we got it on the screen, so it's good. Okay, yeah, Daredevil. There we go. So... I guess it's just a dude jumping out of a, a plane, so maybe it's just... He's just okay. a Daredevil in. I have to note the music here. Oh no, batteries. That's oh. not good. Unbelievable music. It's got a... It's got a... a reverb? If you listen That's closely... That's really cool. I mean, I can't turn it up because my batteries just died on this. Just enough to switch over. Uh, unbelievable music by... Wait, let's go up... Rust Jet 1. Um, he's able to get with only you know two voices. Maybe he's introduced a third voice. Um, a reverb effect. It's very subtle. Wow. Yeah, unbelievable. So big shout out to uh, Rush Jet One. 
Uh, so this is Daredevil 2019 Work in Progress Update by Muddy Funster. This was first posted December 30th, 2018, and we got a uh, preview version Ooh. of it uh, before that. Um, so we, I think we did a world debut. This music's great. It's kick-ass music. Good, good, uh, good job landing really Rush like Jet it. 1. Yeah, uh, man. Uh, and this build is from August 27th. Uh, this is from yesterday, wow, so geez. fresh. And you can download this one right now. Uh, it's a 32K game. Other games, uh, Daredevil, Tire Tracks, and Space Bank. Um, yeah, like I said, it's available on the Atari I suppose this is, forms. I can barely hear it. Oh, no. Well, what I'm going to do is let it run, and I'm going to get batteries. Yeah. It's a good time, because the music's awesome. Yeah, and we had, um, what's uh, some good questions in the chat, just being like, what are your thoughts about programmers putting their names on the screen? I personally think this is no problem. I mean, if you're working your ass off to build this game, the very least that you can get is to throw your name up there. But I mean, there is a level where, like, if every screen is, like, watermarked with your name, like, stretched across, you know, maybe that's too far, so I don't want to, like, totally write it off. But I think, yeah, mentioning your, your stuff, a little, like, almost like a little autograph of, because I mean, it's kind guys aren't necessarily even getting paid for this stuff, right? Like, you're spending years of your lives. No, they're at not getting paid. <laughs> at some point, it might be nice to have your, like, your name on there, you know? So I, I get it. But yeah, if you watermark every screen with your name fully across <laughs> it, it's that's yeah. maybe a bit too much. Yeah, dude, I suppose this woe is yeah, thousand percent true. It is a big wow. You, you should definitely check out the rest of his music that he has posted um, in the Atari Age forums. I believe it goes by Rush Jet, is, or Rush Jet 1 there as well. Um, but the thing I'll say too, man, is like, Muddy Funster, is he the guy who did Because it's Muddy Vision? I'm just assuming. What? Oh, no. Yeah, Muddy Funster. But Muddy yeah, Vision. like, you got a nice logo there, man. Like, look at this, the V, it's like kind of like an Activision style. I mean, you got a great little signature there. That's the thing, it's like, I'll forgive... Or, or embrace any <laughs> signature if it's aesthetically, you know, if you get into the typography of it and it looks good, that's a big deal versus it's like Comic Sans MS, just like, you know, in the corner. So there is a, there's also two, there's classier ways to do it too. So like, why not design like a cool little thing? Cause he's totally right. It's like, you know, um, oh, so I, he also provided some tunes for Tire Tracks. That makes sense. Cause Tire Tracks is really good as well. Cause I remember the music in that one. I think the tone of everything. Um, for that one's really good. Yeah. Okay. Let's get into the game. I'll turn down the music so it's not overwhelming everyone. Yeah, he said. He said, music's great, but it's hard for me to hear what you're saying. <laughs> it no was problem. all about the music. Okay. It's true, man. Yeah. Amazing work, work with the TIA chip. Yes. That little chip that could. Okay. So there's uh, game select here. We're gonna probably just one. start on one. You will have enough trouble with one. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. So there's left, right. Okay. Slow down, speed up, and to land you have to slow down. Okay. Uh, you'll get it. You'll get Let's it. try this. So level one. Okay. So avoid everything except the balloons. The balloons will give you bonuses. It's a nice little intro screen, I think. You oh, yeah, I hit button. it. There you go. Whoa. Avoid the planes. There you go. Okay. Oh, yeah, and then it's like speed up, slow down. Whoa, pixel just Whoa. Shit. barely Okay, okay, I see. Go. I see what's going on. Hi, hey, Atari. Atari. This is Atari. It's hard to get that balloon. Oh, and you're gone. He just came to say hi. Yeah, dude, he's just... Yeah, I don't even know where this balloon... Oh, the cloud won't hurt you, and the geese will just nudge you. So the geese are fine if they, they okay. touch you. Whoa. There's a balloon. I want that balloon. Yay. There you go. Are you invincible okay. now? Am no. I? It okay. looks like that. That's scary. Holy shit. It looks like an invincibility. Okay. Yeah, it's the screen's like speeding up too, man. This is... So I'm going to read through okay. the Holy updates shit. since last time we played. Oh, now oh. just at the last second, you got to slow down. There you go. There you go. You did it. Hey. Okay. Good job. So, January 16th update. So is this level two? Yeah. Cool. Uh, added an extra level Whoa, for okay. some rudim rudimentary uh, sound effects, special effects. 
Some levels now have clouds, a placeholder graphic for now. 50% uh, chance cloud becomes a balloon. Right now, only red balloons. Later versions will have colors for other power-ups, points, etc. So it looks like that was a power-up. Uh, he didn't say whether it was. No. I know it's a really old update. I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm catching up because I want to know Rip. all the updates since last we played. Get it! Uh, well, I just kind of would have died. Uh, crash bug fixed at game over. Uh, January 23rd update. New test build available with functioning balloon, bonus balloons, which we see here. Uh, whoa, and whoa, then shit. there's been no updates since, like, right now. Um, that's the only uh, list of things. Binary attached still has a couple minor uh, cycle issues that need fixing. I'm aware of that, but please do call them out if you see them in case I missed anything. So far, so good. I haven't seen any jumps, what but I've been reading. Mean? Yeah. Oh. See that. Should have gone faster. Oh, yeah, but I also needed to move like to the left too. So yeah. you can do both. I think. No, I yeah. can't. Yeah, you can. Yeah. It's either down or like. It's not eight way. No. Really? It looks like you're going eight way. Rip. Oh, that was quick. Yeah, I only made it like. No, the we're game over screen. You didn't leave it up. Oh, sorry. Got to show the graphic. Okay, off. I got to show this off. Uh, Don't worry, there's a good chance we're going to be game over. <laughs> <See you. laughs> any feedback is valuable, appreciated, gameplay, bugs, or anything. You can jump to any level uh, to test using the game select on the title page. Oh, shit, man. Game one you... equals ga level one and so on. There are eight levels. Then it goes back to level one, but faster. Level X onward. Remember to slow down for the landing. Oh, yeah, I'm thinking I can be more, like, tactful with this one. I'm starting to... Press up to slow down, press down to speed up. It's a nice game concept. Andrew Davy says, like like parachute. No. Uh, you have to oh. zoom zag. Well, 420 is that a cool... That was the inspiration. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Good number. Good number. To... Very, very nice. Uh, so nice. Rip. Yeah. Very nice graphic there. I'm trying to figure out if you use the background for some of it. It looks like you use the play field for the bottom. Yeah, use a play field for the bottom of the uh, grave. The cool little strip stone. of magenta. Yeah. It was really nice. Or pink. Oh, <laughs> it's <easy there> <laughs> okay, let's get that balloon. Nope. Yeah. Too hard. Um, too and hard. so one of the discoveries I had was definitely slowing up and speeding down is like really oh, important. It's essential. Um, but, but it, but there also is some situations that are pretty tough right oh off the God. bat. Cause like there's some, there's some positions ah. like right off the top where you're almost just dead, which is for the fun of these, these style of games. No, you can do eight way direction. You can? Yeah. Cause you can, but I don't think it's necessarily faster. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm not going to get that. Okay. That's good. Too far past it. And if you notice... I think the down is the fastest, though. Straight down? No, it's No, the it's about the... Okay. Um, if you notice, the positional uh, positions of those helicopters as I switch are exactly the same on the next screen. Oh, so yeah, it's a matter of... Um, Watching. Oh, so then there is some tactic, too, to when you release. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you need to get used to looking up at the top before you leave the bottom. That's hey. what I was just saying. Yeah. The height meter, uh, in parachute is nice. I didn't notice that there was a height meter. Oh. Um, and now, uh, level two, there's wind. You can see him Ooh, slightly moving. That's it's a nice little, uh, little, dude, I'm uh, loving the design of this man. Like the, the thing that's the coolest is this seems like fun gameplay, but at the same time, um, graphics are great too. Amazing. And I love the. The different variations of the birds. We have like you know flying saucers. We have like fighter pilots. We have oh, yeah. clouds. Great variation. We have hot air balloons. It's a lot of cool shit. Um, Money Funster, do you do all your own graphic design? Because um, tire tracks obviously it's brilliant. Was, was brilliant, and this uh, continues on that uh, tradition of uh, really nicely detailed colored graphics. Cool. That was close. Got some trees. Oh. Just barely. Oh my god. I, I thought you died. Somebody uh, but the, he's waving, so it's somebody good. in the discussion I, I think he had different points for how far out from I don't know if he's implemented that, but he's going to for how far out of the center you are. Oh interesting. So he you can he... land anywhere. 
He says he mostly does his own graphics. Oh, it makes great sense job. because, you know... Like, look at the trees. It's brilliant, Those man. Are amazing trees. And also like, the, really good and the trees. variation of, like, the lighter green with the darker green. Yeah. And then also the fact that that doesn't match the background. So, yes, it's like... it's So, the, right. so they pop out because it would be easy to make it bleed. And then the yeah, gradient for, like, the, 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 the like, path. stump... You oh, see how it's like yes, dark it's not... brown, light brown, and then it goes to the tree. So it's like yep. very textural. Um, and that, yeah, and I love you have gradients for everything, like that balloon right there, sort of lighter to darker up all the way through. Yeah, it's pretty amazing stuff. Oh, oh my god, dude, it just nice. got even cooler. Nice, that dude, is a huge And also, do you see they're coming up and down now, so yep. they're not just lateral. Yeah, that's cool. And then, yeah, it feels more intense. Oh, so way much more, more intense. intense. Even though it's not. It Is there any flicker? I don't know. The, the, I don't think Oh, that... and the... Uh... No, there's no flicker in this game. Dude. And, and the direction of the snow, rain, uh, is the direction of the wind, <gasps> too. So that's actually more helpful than the last level. Even though it's so visually distracting and, like, makes it really intense. Feels like an environment, though, you know? Yeah. And also that kind of S-shaped kind of sine wave log, between. whatever you want to call it, is such a such a great kind of rhythm to dodge. It is, yeah. It adds, oh god. Ooh, because yeah, right there it just added this extra level. Oh yeah. Yeah, the trees look great, man, for sure. That's Ramirez. Yeah, I'm having to go through things now because of just oh. the timing. It's just too hard to not go through some of them now. Oh my god, I'm gonna make it. Maybe. Man, I feel like we're like special ops. We're just... Ah, the tree! We're just like, you know... No! Ah, oh, rip! So, that was game three. Whoa. So I'm going to go game four now. I think they're like skiing trees. Activision, that's where I got the idea from. Oh, okay. Don't remember what... What? Well, it's back to calm, calm. But they are yeah, but they're, up they're, and down there's still. The, yeah, so it's like there's an... There's uh, still wind. It's. I guess it's like one those games where it's like they, they make it intense and then they calm it down a bit and then it gets more intense again. Have you ever um gone uh, like uh, parachuting before? No, it's just. Do you have any interest? A risk factor that I'm not willing to add to everyday life. <laughs> I feel identical, man, and I it's also like, oh, it's I'm expensive sure I, too. <laughs> ah, I'm it's, sure I would like it, and it'd be a rush. Actually, no, I wouldn't like it. It'd be a rush. But it's, you know, everyday life is dangerous enough. Man, my that I life just don't need to do it. I've never been in like an adrenaline guy Torture myself, these. you know. Like no, like skiing, like I all like that skiing, stuff. But not like, like intense skiing. I do yeah. like skiing. Yeah, and and like like bungee jumping or you know, all that stuff. Uh, None I of it's to go really. through. <gasps> you got oh, it though. Oh my god. god. Yeah, it's not. Oh, I think the speed is is changed quite a bit on this level. Oh yeah, man! Like if you look at how fast those um, helicopters are going, specifically. Whoa. Whoa! What's going on? Oh wow! Where do I land? Anywhere? Anywhere? Okay. Whoa! <laughs> Hold on, that's wow. cool. Huge sunset reflecting in the water, and you're kind of like a desert island with a river going that's through. That's dope. It. What's we got? Never underestimate. I never managed to understand pres. Precision. You could get with this one. It seems the behavior changes on every console. Hmm. I have a problem with some console. We face a problem with Boulder Dash. Sound is too low to hear. There is no sound. Is there sound? Because like I, <laughs> I don't, don't think there is. I any don't sound. see. There's literally. I don't. We like don't zero. Yeah, zero we're not sound. getting any signal. Like maybe when you play the game, but no, I don't see any signal. That could be something from our end. It's possible. Oh. Oh. oh there is sound. It's just really, really quiet. I'll turn it up. Oh, did I pick pick level one? I think I did. I'm just going to die. Oh, yeah, because oh, okay. we got like a there, but... Yeah, you might want to turn up the sound of that in comparison to the music. It's quite, quite low. Yeah. There we go. And okay. looking at the mix of it, too, it's... Let's go to game five. Yeah, because the mu there's no there's no real, like... In-game music. Yeah, there's no ambience. It seems like it's only for, like, specific things that happen. Yeah. There's some something going on, but it's really quiet. Like when you I get, can see it bouncing yeah. a bit, but there's no really sound in the game. Oh, it's good to have you, militant Buddhist. Yeah, welcome. That's what work things do. That's how they, they distract you <laughs> from the important things like zero-page homebrew. Ah! It starts you from the top again. <laughs> 
Oh, and if you notice, yeah, I think somebody was commenting on that. The sky color changes as you go down as well. Look how the blue. Oh, that yeah. one didn't change as much, but the one before did. Let's see if this one. Oh, that was close. Oh, there we I go. Suppose it says, um, can you fade in and out sounds depending on what uh, you are near? Uh, what? <laughs> and then Andrew said, "That's a nice idea." Oh, I As see. In, like, in the game, can, yeah, because like, there's if airplanes and and geese. Oh my god, that dude, would be, be the most immersive shit of all time. It's like, or the geese coming, like, so or, it would be or UFO. Very cool. Wow, that would be amazing. Depending, yeah, oh, and, palm trees and even now. here, like you land, and now you get like the sound of like. Wow. Yeah, it was the you same gotta effect. Do it. You, you gotta, gotta do, do it. This is why I supposed to just gotta watch everybody's games and give sound notes. It's yeah. so good. Yeah, this is is like a Frogger where you can't slow down. Yeah, is that type Frogger. of game. Although forced Frogger. I'm not a big fan of Frogger. Six. In not because it's not a good game, but I was just so bad at it. Like I always played it. <laughs> oh, and yeah? I've never enjoyed because I'm just so bad and I'm just trying like so just bad. a frog gets ah. destroyed. Ah. Oh, Whoa. Yeah, the geese. Is that That's a, right. Is that a bug? No, no, no. It's part of it. The geese don't kill you. Oh. I just forgot and I was like, "Oh, I'm going to die." Oh, I'm not. Geese are just smacking me. I love too. We got like a seaplane up there. We got yeah. like a rocket ship. Yeah. And when you're by the oh, hot air balloons, they could go yeah, not an infinite fall. No. Yeah, no, there's an end, which I love. It's well, great to have those breaks. Well, for a premise, too, like, it's kind of like if you're, like, what what plane did you jump out of to infinitely fall? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's yeah. nice that it, 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 there is a level of um, of immersion that that brings, because, you know. I have to go between them. Oh. Also, infinite games are, are tough, because they just. What did I get to? Seven? Yeah, let's see what seven's. Like. Okay, no, I didn't make it to seven yet. Oh, they're stopping and going. As you... Oh, whoa, As you speed up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, it's almost like slow motion. Uh, whoa, what is happening? We've entered nice. into the Matrix. That's right. Wait, you... Yay, I'm getting balloons. This one we makes it easier balloons. to get balloons. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Actually, this is easier than the, than the others because... You get a, oh, maybe not. You get a little break. Yeah, it's it's different, and that's what's cool. It's cool that it's like a different kind of rhythm, yeah. so that way it's it it definitely boosts like playability. Well, maybe it's not as easy. No, it's just a different. It's a completely it's totally different, different tactics, which is like very cool because it's like a different game now. Because oh, you need yeah. to imagine like where it's gonna end up. It's more tactical, I'd say. Very tactical, because you have to dodge the movements. Yeah. Uh. Oh. Oh, damn it. I gotta do that one again. I wonder if background clouds could be added. Um, in between the... Everyone's um... <laughs> giving sound notes. <laughs> sound notes. <laughs> it's like a pop sound effect when you get the balloon would be nice. Oh, he, yes, yes, definitely. He's, he's totally right, man. I'd say that's like, actually, if you think about like the theme of um, of the feedback... I'd say that like everyone seems to be down with sound? with uh, you know your graphics oh, and your gameplay, gameplay and stuff. Yeah. It just seems like the sound is the next kind of mountain to climb with this film. Sorry, <laughs> game. Oh, mine's on film. Well, that's oh, just because I always say that sentence all the time. So yeah, it's like my go-to. I'm like this film. It's like, what? Damn it! So close. Also, does the uh, cloud kill you? No, you just pass through. It. Cool. Because I was gonna say that would be a bit silly. That would be, yeah. Uh, oh, yay! Hey. yay! How long does that last? A while. Right before you get in front of something. Yeah, so you still <laughs> have key. to... Oh, like two levels. Damn it. Okay, here. Oh, cool. Sorry, I'm putting you on level seven. No, we man. Gotta, we gotta finish level seven. There is a pop sound. Oh. It's not coming through. Oh. Well, I can crank it up. I don't want to burst shit. your eardrums. Whoa, whoa, okay, yeah, this is tough shit, man. Okay, let's get the balloon. Oh, yeah. Okay, there is a yeah, sound. Yeah, there is a You guys sound. should have heard that now. I, I oh, cranked I'm up seeing... the sound. Oh, it's tough, man. Yeah. I thought this level was going to be easier, but it's not. Because you really have to calculate what's going on. And it's hard to get ahead of the person. Whoa. Oh, God. Watch the top row. Yeah, it's like... you got to... Think ahead for the top row. Ah, oh, uh, it's, it's left behind it. Okay. Hold oh, can I you try can one more? Yeah. Just because, like, I'm not very good at it, so I have to. As look. you fall, there's a heartbeat sound that gets quicker. Okay, Whoa. so he's got a lot in here. Yeah, it's just... It's just really subtle. 
I'm going to turn it up here. Let's see. It is. Oh, it's there. There's you got to mix it better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it's quite quiet. Which is okay. And if, if you got hard because... thing is getting the elements in, man. Yeah. Um, because oh. the heartbeat is is not a continuous thing, I think it could be much louder. Whoa. Rip. One more. Yeah. Yeah, try one more and see if I and can. Gotta... And then I'm gonna pass Hand it, it over. Back. Yeah. Maybe Just... you guys should turn up the sound a bit. The heartbeat is super quiet. It's tough though because it's also you know. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll for sure do more. it though. Sorry about that. Yeah. It's hard to mix it because I can't I can't hear what you guys hear. I mean, I could, but, but I'd, be, if we, I'd be wearing headphones Where, where it's time. revealing, though, is this... You can hear the sound of the balloon, that blink, is way louder than, say, for example, the heartbeat. Oh, see, I, was th I thought I'd be able to get it. But... <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on now. But, dude, I love that idea of, like, getting the sounds. Because your environment is so textural. You have it all is. these interesting... Yeah. Oh god. Oh, you could do it. You could do it. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh. oh. Okay. Back. You done. What a tough game. Oh yeah. It's not easy. It looks like it's gonna be easy. Like just avoid the things. Just avoid them. That's all you gotta do. Yeah. Not you think it's like? It should be a cakewalk. It is far from it. Oh my you god. You can use the birds to help you. Uh. Yeah. Push you across the screen. Definitely. If you're in. If. You're in a position where it's... it's an, uh, yeah, if you're an opportunist and the opportunity arises, hell yeah. Oh, God. I think the fact that it's sort of... There we go. It's not random, but it kind of um, is harder to predict. Damn it! Like that, right? It is. It's just... And I think that's what makes... Yeah. Whoa, what is that? Can I, I shoot that, them? What is red? That's infinite. No! What is red? I need instructions. <laughs> it's the monkey face, James. <laughs> nice. Everyone knows the monkey face uh, balloon. <laughs> the monkey face. Balloon. Score boost. Ah, that makes oh, sense. Oh, okay. So it doesn't help me at all, except for score. Whoa. Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. If you're one of those, whoa, whoa, whoa. If we were doing one of those. Uh, yeah. Those like what? What? What's those challenges? Where you got uh, high score challenges. Just ran away. No, the the yeah, one that's <laughs> the. <laughs> Ah, the one that's like um uh homebrew. Yeah, the home showdown thing. Totally, uh, we have to get like a bunch of you know numbers. And yeah, then of then course, yeah, then good. that would be helpful. This would be a fun one to do that on. Oh yeah. Could you imagine grinding for like a high score in this? It would be like God. be a hell of a journey. It would be. Okay. Okay, I can do this. I can do it. White is um invincible. Red is score. Okay, okay. perfect. I think I'm almost there. One more. One more. One more. God. You know what's really Damn coolest? it! Man, one of the coolest screens of all time is like the beginning of Pac-Man where it like shows you all this stuff. You remember that oh. screen? It's very cool. Like the all the oh all the points, all the Yeah, it shows you the all the different things. It shows you like you take this, you know. It's like ah. I love those I love that screen because it's like it's 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 almost like, you know. Yeah, John Shampoo did that with Galaga. Um yeah, did a we're... great job of it, but it's a lot of work. Oh my god, it's a yeah. Lot of, it's a lot of work and a lot of memory to do that. And it's so not it's necessarily very unusual essential. to have in a game. Very unusual to have in a 2600 game. Because you have to do everything. There's no character set built into the 2600. Yeah. So you actually have to put in the graphics for everything. Everything you do. Every letter. Every number. Um, it's, it's tons and tons of work. He said flying through a cloud should turn on the rain. Is that Is true? That? Dude, I we, did that once. We got <laughs> yes. Now you're, okay, if we get a cloud, man, we'll fly right well, through definitely. that. Definitely, I'll head for it if I can. Okay, so this should last till the next. Phew! Oh, level. sorry. I was sneezing. There we go. Over. Yeah, it's exactly two levels it lasts for. The uh, the flashing. <gasps> Want another one, please. Infinite. No more points. Oh, oh, oh my god! god. Seeding oh. the clouds. Seeding. I want to see. I want that cloud thing. We got to see about that. Oh yes, 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 yes. Oh, oh no. no. It's, it's hard. Yeah, it's not an easy... It slows down and you're like, no, I'm going to miss this it. This is definitely in the category of games oh. that uh, that's harder than it looks. Yeah. Definitely. Because oh, yeah. like playing it, like watching you play, you're I'm like, like Come on. my God, James, this, I could do this. Oh. Cloud. No, it's too far. Go, 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 go. Holy shit. So you're like fighting gravity. Oh, like... oh my God. Come on. Oh, birds. Get up. 
Well, that's, oh my but god. But see how much Super. louder those are? Like yes, then, burp, 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 versus the kind of the heartbeat, heartbeat is so low. Yeah. It's it's hard. It sound mixing is, is not an easy thing. No. And and everybody has a different um speaker setup. Um everybody has different uh ears even. Yeah, some for different frequencies. Oh my god, you know? yeah. And some people have like, you know, put stupid headphones in their ears forever and blast it at full volume. Other people have like barely their ears are great. Yeah. You know, so you just, it's hard. Oh my God, come on. Um, my, I, remember, I heard that there's like that most hilarious so statistic hard. I remember hearing once was that like most people, by the time they can afford to buy like expensive speakers, their hearing go, is, go, go. is oh. so damaged that they can't really tell the difference. Yeah. It's the, it's the hilarious the thing. The irony of it. Yeah. Cause when you're like a kid, uh, you can hear. Here we go. No. no, that would be sick. Maybe sometimes. I don't know. <laughs> But not that time. Yeah, well, oh. it, it, it totally, like, the heartbeat should be in the background and not distracting. Very true. Definitely. But if, but if you can't hear it, like, we can't hear and it. And that's the challenge of a mix, We're right? Talking. Like, finding that threshold between, like, you know. I, I heard once no. someone said to me, like, which I think was so true, is like a, he was a music guy, and he said to him, like, knowing that threshold go, go, between, go. like, when you can tell that there's an effect and there yes. isn't, that's knowing when that is, that's Just. everything. And you have to listen to it on a bunch of different speakers and setups and like, like reverb, like sound, like everything. It's like you gotta find like nothing. Wait. Yeah, got nothing from that. It's trolled, man. <laughs> it's like threading a needle with with going through, because you have to just. <sighs> yeah. That doesn't turn on the rain. Did somebody just? Does say it, they wanted that to happen? I think that might or, have, Well, it would sound... Or Muddy Funster said it actually. Oh, no, it was Andrew Davey who oh, said it. Oh, okay. I, I think he... I just felt... I felt the confidence in his tone <laughs> made me... He, Believe. Totally. Ah, come back here, balloon. Oh. You know, the original, like, the long form of con men is the confidence man. Yeah. Because yeah, exactly. it's like, if you say something so confidently, people are like, of course. That totally makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, this level's so hard. I okay. love it. We're gonna go to level 8. Muddy Funster's like, it doesn't turn off the rain yes. yet. Ooh, see, this, uh, the, that's my... Oh, is it different balloons? The oh, top it's one? random Holy movements now. Cow. It's not a set speed up, slow down. Whoa. But the speed ups and slow downs aren't as extreme. I don't think. It's still bloody hard. God. Uh, Easy, this game is not. No. Did you see the new Star Wars trailer? I did. It, 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 I don't even know, like, what... I mean, it's early days, but I got no concept of what this plot is at all going to be. It's Which is fine. I guess you know? it's a teaser, right? It's just... Yeah, uh, yeah it is teaser. It's teaser territory it's right now. Yeah. Um, For the... For the time gap between when the movie comes out, which is November, so it's still a long way. Yeah. Away. I'll give it to you after this. <laughs> oh, sure. Sorry. Oh, no, no, no worries. Actually, November's not that far away, really. Uh, if we think enough, about it. In terms of marketing, it's still... I guess you're right. It's like we're three months out. Far. Yeah, they don't do the intense... I love the last trailer. Um, uh, the latest one? Uh, the one before this one. Is like... that the one where she's just standing in the... Well, she did desert and then jumps over jumps the thing. Up. Yeah, that and... was very effective. Yeah, but like that's where I'm now, and now I'm looking at these things, being like, well, "What are they gonna do? Like, they're resurrecting characters left, right, and center. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it's crazy. I I really don't care anymore. Actually, I, I know it's tough. It's like and <laughs> the, I ah I, I have like this is definitely challenging enough. This is at the right level because I was able to get up at least to level five. I didn't get six either, but. I know I can do this. It's not like, oh, this is impossible. It's just a matter of practice. It's like trying to get my Activision patches. Oh, I should have gone behind it. That's the choice you have to make every time. That was just dumb. Okay. That's the choice you have to make every time. Do I go in front of it or do I go behind it? Oh my god, man. I'm fucked. <laughs> Holy mm -hmm. shit. You make a decision. To chase or to not chase? Yes. That is, yeah, exactly. That, that is the question, my friend. <clears throat> whoa. Whoa, birds. Help me, birds. 
pushed me across. There you go. They helped you out a little bit. Yeah, I was Watch trying to use. I was, I was like, go. let's try to like, let's try this out. Okay, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Uh, no, no, you're good. You're good. You're good. Okay. Oh, you're gonna have to thread the needle. Oh yeah. Should have. You should have. Yeah, I should have like. It was too far ahead. You just you make a decision and you, you have to stick with it because you're done. Oh god. Ooh, yeah, you're fine. You're okay, fine. Okay. You're good. You're good. Oh, my god. You're gonna have to thread it. Or not. Oh no! no! I was like, I was trying to get clever. That's what happens. Landing when you get... on eight is probably the toughest of the lot. Oh no! So that's not even the hard part is getting that's to the hilarious. end of eight. That's hilarious. You haven't even like I haven't even reached seen the ground yet. Okay, seen so we got one. How many screens do you? Think I'm guessing got? it's the desert. Uh, I think there's probably eight. Eight screens <sighs> makes sense. I went for it. And paid off. Thank yeah. God. Whoa! You just missed that guy. Oh no! no. It's it's. You were t you were stuck there by the time you got to him. You couldn't go behind or in front. You were too close. These balloons are a nice bonus, but they don't come up aligned very often. Oh, oh no. see, like you just try. Like it's hard because it's. Uh... I think more often than not, you should go behind the item. Yeah, I think you're right. Like, like don't like, aim for in front. The, always... Yeah, you're right. Go the opposite direction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's actually a really good because idea. Because you can always make it there. But like I, I, what I've been trying Whoa, to do. Because yeah, like their mistake. But how do you? It's so hard. You kind of ease into it. Ease into the back of it. Okay. Oh, I want to try it one more time. Yeah, for sure. I'll try. Okay. This is my last I one. I declare this game a one, one more time. Totally. Game. It's, it's definitely one of those. Oh, fuck where you're yeah. like, you know, you can do it, and you don't, and then you're like, ah, oh, I'm just gonna play it one more time. I know I can get it. You're like, we're so close to a breakthrough. <laughs> yeah. It's like, are we? <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, I it's tough because it's all about like where you end up. Sometimes you get like a free. Pass, Do know? the birds wrap around and push to the edge? They wrap. Is this your effort, Muddy Funster? Yes, this is Muddy Funster's game. Oh, whoa, see, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Yeah, oh. that was a tough one. Vertical movement of the enemies. Um, they do come back, like just not in this level. And they are spaced a little differently. And, oh, oh I was like, I, I was like, oh. maybe they are moving a little bit. Okay, here you go. But they're just not moving all the time. Oh. That's a game. That's a game. This is a game. I declare this. I a declare game. this a game. Oh, they are moving. They just kind of shift up and down sometimes. There we go. Yeah, but it's so subtle. I didn't even notice that they were moving. Oh God. Yeah. See, they move in their slow. Oh. Which adds to the difficulty because you're not just judging their horizontal um, adjustments, <laughs> their, their vertical adjustments. Muddy, Muddy Fuster just said, I wanted it to be easy to pick up and have a must try again factor. You, you fucking nailed, nailed that, dude. Yeah, Hell yeah. This is all about that. It's to catch you out. <laughs> I will call it a success, too. That's what Carl ah! said. Definitely. I think you farther than I got. I want to so see if we can fucking get at least one landing today yep. in this oh, level. Because yeah. he said it's the hardest. Are we there? Are we almost there? Oh, come, come on. One no! More, one, more. one more, one more. Whoa, no! Dude! Oh, my God. Oh, no! Holy shit. You got this. You got this. Oh, my God. The Are dream is joking, alive. Are you joking, Muddy Funster? A moving platform? So good. You got one more life, man. Yeah, but you got the whole thing. Again. You do? Fuck. It's just as hard. Oh, I forgot. That yeah, that's, you, it doesn't help. It does. You restart. You got to nail the whole level in yeah. one life. Oh, damn. It's like a hard boss, but you have to go through the whole thing to get to the hard boss. This and feels you don't like, have any practice. It's like a Castlevania game now yeah. or something. It's crazy. Kicking butt, though. Yeah, yeah. I, get, I made it. So I'm... Carl G just said that, like, a moving platform. I didn't get that far. So, like... <laughs> Well, we are only playing this one level yeah. over and over, so I'm but, not like. But it also means. Rip. Fuck. We saw it though. We you saw did it. See it. We saw the Sasquatch. It's real. I want to at least try. I didn't make it to the landing, trying the landing, so I want to. Like, that's what you have to do is kind of stay right close to it as possible. Like, even then, it's hard. Like, you saw that. Come on! Oh. Man, the other thing that was really good that just came out is the new Dave Chappelle stand-up special. It's really amazing. It's probably it's, one of his best. I wouldn't say best. I it's loved it's it. Pretty, he's got some really good parts in it. I'd say that's out of his sure. new stuff, for sure. That's my opinion. Uh, uh, I think his first one was the best one out of his new the stuff. The very first one, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's it's you're comparing such good material. Uh, I think with the first one is uh, where he talks about... Um, 
Cosby as a superhero. Oh god, that, you're right. I think oh. that is the best bit of all out of all three. That's pretty insane. Yeah. yeah. And then also when he breaks down like kind of like this the pimp psychology with that book and then like oh, kind of yeah, relates yeah. it to first his experience in capitalism. So is that the good. first one? Yeah, yeah. Okay, it yeah, is. man. The first, first one is great. But this one's really cool too. This one's too. better than the second one. Yeah. Um because there's some really good uh really good bits in it. And it's pretty amazing cuz he's in a place in life where he can really just say whatever he wants, <laughs> and he's which like, is eh. cuz most people aren't in that place, you know, they no. don't they don't have that luxury. So it's very cool that there's an artist out there who just literally his job is just to say what he's he got thinks. enough money. <laughs> he's set up. He doesn't have to do anything ever again. Um, he's got his home situation set up, you know? Yeah, and he just, he basically just does stand up, like, it's cool, it's cool when they're, when you see someone who just clearly this is their thing, and they're yeah. so good at it, uh, I find it's so inspiring. Yeah, yeah. It's just like, it's and like, not caring, because he says some stuff that I'm like, oh, you really... I, why why are you saying that well yeah and i and then you're you also blown away this. by his ability to get away with saying some of this stuff too that's also like well you know comedians. the master of that is louis ck yeah he can say things that no one else no one else can say it's true in his position um i mean not anymore but yeah he's not for he, a while he's done. oh no i know i know it's okay it's... yeah he's done for a while yeah. but i think he is uh he is my favorite comedian Oh, Louis yeah. CK. For sure. I love Louis. I like his TV his, show his a lot, word man. Smithing is, oh, it's brilliant. That makes me sad that that's the to me the saddest thing about the whole um, the fallout the um, was yeah. was losing his TV show cuz his stand-up specials are, you know, they're pretty cool, but like, man, I love that um, I love that show. It's really inspiring. It is. It's really inspiring because he he does a lot of things that most shows don't do. And he just does it. He just, Damn he's, it. he's got a camera and he just films and, and he gets it and writes it and acts in it and, and he like, does everything. Fucking Robin Williams was in it. Like it's crazy the, the people who were there. Mark Marin and like, you know, Sarah Silverman and all these great comedians. It's... Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm playing this so much. No, yeah, I just realized the fact that we're talking about comedians means that... <laughs> okay, this is my last game, yeah. whether or not I make it. Um, yeah, it's got to be. we got to keep going. got to keep going. People are going to be like, yeah, we've seen this. Yeah, we've seen this and... <laughs> A million times. We know it's fun. But, uh, yeah, you guys should definitely download this immediately after the show if you have not played it. Um, this version is not out... So um, I definitely think he should release it. There's not no game breaking. Oh bugs. my god, this is like totally. Unless it's too close to the final and he doesn't want to, you know, put out I, yeah a, a cartridge close to cartridge version of it. Um, and if this isn't being demoed at PRGE, you should definitely talk to <laughs> Al if he's got some space uh, to get this demoed. And I'm gonna make it too. I believe, I believe. <laughs> oh my God, this game there worked. We go. Dude. Holy shit! You know what? You know what the difference between the last game and this one was? You were totally watching the top of that screen. A I could tell you were totally. Now, like, and I got the threading down now. Yeah. Um, between you have to do the diagonals. You have to just skim the edge. So let's see level nine. Whoa! Level A nine. level X. Level X. Ooh. Okay. This is level X. This is the xenomorph. <laughs> <laughs> so they're not moving up and down. No. What's going on? What's how's this? Back to normal. Oh well, that's all you got to see of level X. Sorry, friends. You have to try and get there yourself now. I'm interested, as are many. As are many. Yes. So good ending. I made it. Um. Fuck yeah. Okay. So definitely uh, download that when uh, Muddy Funster puts it out. Hell yeah, addictive, um, great. It's, it's a just one more try game. You, you know what, man? When the notes are, you could have a more immersive soundscape. Yeah, <laughs> you've 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 done well, my or your friend. Or your sound mix isn't quite right. It's like those are those are like. <laughs> last minute notes those are, those are like not even dotting the i's and crossing the t's that's like yeah. that's like okay this is working uh how can we like push the last little yeah. bit yeah the 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 balance of gameplay is right there he it's says he, perfect he says you missed the shark from tire tracks is that an easter egg Where is, is that, that is that uh, dude, it I, didn't come up 
Maybe oh. it did, and we were so immersed. Oh, you in, know what? In... It might have been on level um, seven, or and something. we didn't make it to the end of level seven. I'm sorry. We're, we'll do that next time when you're finished the game, or yeah, man. when there's a big. He said update. he's in the water. I bet you. I bet you the last the one. last level. Well, how it just didn't come up, or or, maybe, or we didn't see it. I, it's very possible because we're so like in. I don't know. Zoned in. Okay. Um, hold down the button. Got it. Uh, and we're gonna switch over to. Oh, it didn't. Oh, it didn't hold down for long enough. Oh, oh, hold on, it's green work. Shit. Didn't see that. Uh, then you know you're good. Yay, nailed it. So we're okay. gonna go over to Chaotic Grill, Ooh. which is a port of Burger Time. Um, bottom oh, one. Hold down the button, you'll see what it is. Nope, the other one. Okay, cool. NTSC version. This is by Philip Blackman, aka Splendid Nut, who is with us in the channel. And that blasted your ears off. Oh, so. yeah, I remember this one. This is a hard one. Yeah. Should I just jump in? Should we? Um, yeah, we played this before, so you can just jump in. Oh, yeah, what's the what's the goal again? Uh, to get all the burger pieces down to the bottom. Oh, so yeah, okay. The best tactic is to go to the top and, then not and drop them sequentially, always dropping the uh, top bun piece. Okay, so this was first posted. <coughs> Sorry, I was sneezing. It's first, terrible. First posted uh, four years ago. He started in on this game. December 15th, 2015. And you get the ice cream cone for bonuses, uh, an extra pepper, which you can throw at them if you're in a, okay, in a jam. Okay, good. And you do want to trap the guys with the buns. Do that, do it now, do it now, do it now, do it now. Okay. There you go. I was going to knock so that you guy destroy down. that guy. Cool. Okay, so this And guy you can kind of manipulate which direction they go. There you go. By... They go in a beeline for you. They go for the most direct route possible. Oh, so there's... A, there's obviously, there's some... There's some, some tactics. Potential there. Yeah, so you can... Like, that's... that's. Like, I mean, this isn't great, but I'm also like... I don't know if like, you saw that. I don't know if that's a bug or not. We'll get to that. Where you can walk off a ladder one up from the ladder. Obviously, that is a bug. When he continues walking on nothing. But... Um, like there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, you're good. You're good. You're all good. Lead them over. Oh, no. You could have done that, but that's fine. Now, also, while you're walking across something, if they're following you really close, you can get them to fall down with the bun. So stop. Oh, oh shit. Sorry. Okay. okay, that it's makes okay. sense. That makes. You're far enough ahead that you're not in danger. Danger. It's a bug, Splendid Nut says. Okay. Obviously, he knows about it. Cool. Like that. But eventually he hops down, and that's what should happen. I mean, it's good to have that... Ooh, whoa. <laughs> Holy it's shit. good to have that leverage of being able to get off a ladder earlier, because some games are too precise. It's like, you have to uh -oh. be on this exact pixel. You're almost done. I think I'm One just more. gonna... Yay! Okay, so I got the things. I mean, I didn't necessarily kill that many guys. But... Uh, so this build is from August 18th, so a week and a bit ago. It's a 32k game. Uh, this is the first game that Splendid Nut has ever done wow. on the Atari 2600, and it is quite something. Is this based off of anything, or is this yeah. just fully like... Yeah, this is like... based off Burger Time. Oh, cool. An arcade game, a beloved arcade game, and I would have never tackled it as my first one. Okay, throw the pepper at him. There you go. Take that. You have to be close enough to throw the pepper. Cool. So it okay, doesn't, let's doesn't get have to a know. far projectile, but... Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Don't trap yourself. Uh oh, uh oh. There you go. Uh oh. Go. There you go. Whoa. See, because you went down, they're like, oh, we gotta go down. Oh, so yeah, there is a lot of tactics yeah. to this to this stuff right here. Uh, Thrust asked, uh, do diagonals work? Yes. So that's another way to get off a ladder or to go up a ladder is to diagonal uh -oh. it. You know that tactic? No, okay, okay. Well, I got it. So you kind of press up to the right to get off a ladder that you want to go to the right from. <laughs> It's a crazy soundtrack, man. Great music. Yeah. Really, really good. Okay. It's a very methodical game, and it feels to me, you know, you're very like. It's kind Militant of... Buddha, Buddha says, damn it, this is going to get expensive. Yeah, there's a lot of games in the works right now. Oh, whoa, boy. Whoa. Go down, 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 down. There you go. There's a lot of games in the works that are really, really good that are coming up. Um, okay, let's read the updates. Uh, this is available in the Atari Age forums. We played this last June 26, 2019, so uh, not 
not too long ago, but... Oh, you did it. Oh. I was getting scared. I was yeah. like, it's... You don't have unlimited peppers, but you do have four still. Oh, you're getting oh, it's cornered. Getting, it's getting oh, you can do it. You can do it. Oh, ah, no. Get uh, out of there. Pepper. Pepper. Oh, nice. Holy shit. Oh, you got one more to get. There you ah, go. Go ah, down. Oh. You're kicking ass. Oh, my God. That was wow. tight. Oh, that was getting scary. Okay. Erlen does not know. Both diagonals and four-way style play are supported. Yeah. Oh, thanks, man. I don't know much, so that's good. <laughs> uh, so, July 5th update. Uh, time for update. Long overdue. I've done major work inside the Burger Logic code. Burger Logic. Yeah. I just think that's a funny that's... phrase. Oh, dude, I killed one of them. <laughs> nice. Uh, which mainly involved merging two active burger lists into one. When I originally added uh, the bounce effect to the burgers, which is awesome. All these little, little things really make... Whoa. Ooh, good, good shooting. You don't have any left. Uh oh. And to get them, you have to get that middle item that appears. Once really? In a while. Okay, I gotta get that thing yeah, then, because it's yeah, once pretty key to the. Uh, oh yeah. To the strategy here. Oh, yeah. I don't think it'll, I'm gonna survive long without get you pepper. Out of, get you out of a fix. Yeah, it might be done. Whoa, There's some fries. I'm gonna get some fries. Give me those. Yeah, fries. it doesn't last. Uh oh. Uh oh. You gonna get it? Yes, you did. Whoa. Okay, you gotta learn. You gotta learn a tactic. Okay. Here, okay. So to kill them, go up around. To to get rid of some of them while you're walking across the burger, uh, do it now. There you go. See that? Yay! Oh my it'll god! It'll take them down. It won't kill them, but it'll take them down a level. That's really which good. Which gets them out of the way. So if one's okay. kind of close to you, you can wait. Whoa! So let's just check this out. Oh! oh I thought I had to just do pepper it. Pepper sprayed I'm... your own face. Uh oh. Won't be the first time. There you go. <laughs> ah, it's just like danger. It's, it's a Tuesday night for me, James. <laughs> yeah. That's right. I just, Party want, time. I just want to feel, you know. Oh, God, <laughs> I feel alive. That's right. I'm gonna pepper spray my own face. I love watching. Oh, I love is a strong word, but I've seen some <laughs> of those um, uh, pepper spray videos online, and it's always hilarious because it's like everyone's so macho oh, before God. the pepper spray comes out, and then afterwards, it's They're like it's so. a different story. You're doing really well. You've never played this game no. before. You're doing really well. It's very meditative. It feels like I wouldn't say. Oh, that... you're you're. you're... Uh -oh. There you go. Oh, you could have. That's okay. I'm just playing safe. You're doing really well. Cause, like, Lead them on. Because seriously. Play defensively. Yeah. Because I think I can do this now. Because, see, it's like I'm sending them on quite the route. So I'm going to actually do this. It's opposite to maybe what we should do. You have to do it twice again, so it's... Oh, oh no, lead them around again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take them on a trip. Oh. You are faster than them. Uh, oh, Splendid Nuts says Kurt, Kurt Woolwich helped out a lot with the music. It's good music, uh, man. It's, it's very music. good music. Yeah. Um, uh, uh, so I've done, uh, la, 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 la. Okay, good. this turned out to be a bad idea because it caused a few rare oddball bugs. Bur burgers were getting replicated. Whoa. That's not good. And burgers were getting stuck mid-flight. Very shit. rare. But do you have yeah. any pepper left? How do I know? You have we four. Pepper. Okay. So I guess you got a bunch back. Or you collected a bunch. I collected some, yeah. As I was yeah. going, I was... Once Start I, from the top. Once I realized don't... that was the thing, I was like, yeah. These are full burgers that you're going to have to do every level on. You gotta use more of that tactic. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yep, good choice, good In choice. In your face, stupid thing. Good choice. Yeah, oh boy. Oh, you're gonna have to use some pepper. That's okay. It's boring to use pepper. This one's tough because they can get right to you. Oh, maybe I should get that. Because there's ladders everywhere. That's not a bad idea to get that. Oh, God. Okay, so like... You're gonna yeah. have to be doing a lot of dodging. Or a lot of killing. I think I have like a sort like a of lead, an idea. This one's a good one to lead them on and drop them. Well, not really, because it only goes down one level. Yeah, it's just, I feel like this is, this is a very methodical game, is what this feels like to me. Yeah, you there's know? no time limit, so you're fine to. Oh, I thought I was going to get it. Do you see, like, I, I, uh, one, one I was. Oh, one away. Oh, yeah, I was a little bit off, man. Uh, uh, utilizing the do? TIA tracker files provided by Kurt Woolwich, I've been able to get the musical cues very close to the arcade. Whoa. And the sound effects have been improved a bit, too. I've got six peppers now. That's really good. They, you need those. I think you can get up just to nine. Oh, fuck. Yeah, oh, it doesn't get them completely. Oh, I, I was curious. I was trying to tactic. I guess I have, like, a few, so. Yeah. I was like, I don't want to, like... There you go. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, well, what's that stuff. thing, man? Oh, no, it's just a regular one. I was, like, yeah, for a second there, I was... Egg, thinking. sausage, pickle... 
I think those are the bad guys. Uh, minor patches have been uh, made to realign the pepper spray and to hide the wrong sprite displayed error that occasionally happens. I have to revisit the sprite flicker management. Related to that, I started looking at the way to do Luma Boost, suggested by Thomas Yench. Whoa, it all comes together, man. We weren't talking yeah, about that. We were. Well, in relation to this. Because this is a game that utilizes flicker. Whoa. Um, very effectively. Obviously, there's a lot of guys on the screen at the same time. Um, and they clump together. In this game, it's a little it's a little difficult because there's a lot of clumping. Because uh, unlike, um, unlike Pac-Man, where all the characters have their own... <gasps> Did you see that? That was oh really good. You trapped him on the burger. Ah, oh, that's a good tactic. Ah, oh, uh, there was one I didn't get. Uh, uh, I think it out, might have come out of it, too. Oh, that's too bad. That was a good tactic. I thought I was like, I was like, man, I'm nailing this, but I wasn't. It's okay. You still got three lives. That's good. Slices fall farther with riders. I did not know that. So having Whoa, a guy dude, on it makes this it is go fucked. further. Look at this. Yeah. Look at these, like... Deadly ladders. Like, oh, you're going to get trapped on them. Oh, I don't have any pepper left. Oh, oh see, this is where this is where this game gets hard. <laughs> yep. Yeah, because I, I was like, I had I had like a technique and everything for like the other one, but like, yeah, this is different. This each each level adds new. This is a new, new complexity. Yeah, and yeah. look, and I can't actually like go. You can't up, escape. Once but look, you're on look a, at this. This is that's like, like a mappy level. Like you were. <sighs> yeah, and try and get that in time. I'm gonna do it. It's happening. Come on, buddy. Come Use on. the angles. Oh, you got it. You got it. There you go. Squish that. Whoa, and then, oh, there's no way up, too. Oh, and I gotta re-go through all this, too, because we have to slowly bring it down. Yeah. Such a methodical game. Uh, also, I've added the ability to easily build a PAL 60 version for those who want it. It's not complete. The Atari H logo and title screen still have the wrong colors, but it's a start. Yeah. Yeah, it's deadly. Wow. Deadly. It's a long path to go. Oh, you missed it. Oh, get that guy. Oh, all of them. Nice job. Holy shit. Yeah, look at this. So now I kind of have a bit of a... A pattern a going A bit down. of a rhythm that I can I can use here. Try and time it up so you get the guys. Oh, uh, but I also think there's something to be said about just, there, there, just oh, nailing oh, you it. You, got you know it. what I mean? Like, oh, you're going to get it. You're going to get it. As long maybe. as that sausage goes to the right. Yes. Just keep following him. Don't get too close. Don't get too close. Dude, okay. Wow, Ooh. wow, you're kicking ass. This is your game. <sighs> Not necessarily. This is your game. <laughs> I just do it. Some games I have. <laughs> uh, Andrew Davey, I think it's really well done, but I'd love to see better oh, sprite. God. They see that this is management. like. It's. Like, what oh, do you do? Boy. You gotta get them both at once. There you go. You rescued it. No, don't go up there. Oh, I thought I was gonna be able <laughs> no, to kill him. You're dead. No. Let's see. That's where the tactics are. Okay, yeah. August 17th update. It's been a while. Time for another update. Thinks I've ch worked on change. Started the cool. change the start and music and main theme to match what Kurt Wallach provided. Added a difficulty ramp up by adding enemy fractional movement. Enemies oh. speed increase with level whoa, progression. Whoa, 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 dude. Oh, like... catch him. You gotta catch him. You gotta use that. Oh, oh my god, go down. Oh, god. Yeah, you're right. I had to go down. Ooh, yeah. This is a hard level, man. It's all... It, the level design is everything here. Well, yeah. Okay, get that guy. Get... Oh, oh see, and I'm fucked. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of dead ends on this Yeah, one. this is tough, because it's the first one that I've kind of... Do you want to... Do you want to... Uh... No, you keep playing. You're really good at it. I so. don't know if I... But we'll get to that level, because you can uh, do a, this Oh, one. that's awesome. There you go. Wow, I actually made it like pretty really far. Like, what level are we at? It's like level five or six. Oh, well, you could have got him. I... And, and those dead ends, what you do is you catch them. Oh, the pepper is going fast and furious Oh, it's here. tough because I'm like, there's just so many. Yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's very good. Anyway, you know what you're doing. Oh, not necessarily. <laughs> there's a level of improvisation okay, with the you game. You gotta catch them. Wait till they catch... Wait, wait! Go. See, at least you got one. Yeah, well, at least so that's we got what you one gotta of these do. guys. Yeah, because otherwise got... they just chase you forever. There you go. Okay. Now you're doing it. Oh, oh fuck, boy, man. Pepper! Oh god! <laughs> but they don't turn around. Uh oh. Okay, catch him. Yeah, you gotta use Pepper anyway. Uh oh. And another one. Yeah. Jesus Christ! <laughs> what a level! I think this level is the, the hardest the, the, one out of all of them. Yeah. I mean, how many levels are there in this game? Man? I know there's more. Uh, there's gotta be. I'm. Fixed player control issues so that when you're near intersections, players will be able to slide towards the intersection. 
You are pressing Whoa. a direction that's only yeah, available at the sexy. intersection. Yeah, it end up. Worked on a few graphical glitches I believed I eliminated with the issue of corrupt graphics, phantom sprites appearing. Still more work to be done. Title screen, which uh, he wants to, I guess, do more work on. Uh, high score table and save key support. Awesome. Maybe better flicker management. Um, it's a tough flicker management game. Because, like... Oh, oh see? No. There, oh, yeah. But your last pepper is gone. Oh, but it was okay. well used. It, yeah, man. You gotta, well you gotta do it. I see what okay, you had now. Trap him. Wait. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you're right. You it's... still would have died anyway because the pickle was right after you. Wow, what a toughie. Uh, maybe more levels. Maybe some other cool things. Yeah, the more. No. Oh, shit. The more levels, always the better. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to beat this one. I'll keep working. Oh, oh no. Is that the last level? I don't think so. We'll check it out next time. Yeah, it just requires a completely oh, different... Oh, six, which repeat. Maybe this is the last level. It requires like a completely different oh, set yeah. of tactics, man, for this shit. It's like... Completely different. Ugh, I'm wasting him, but it's like, you know, you gotta, like, you just gotta get it sometimes, you know? Okay, wait. Wait for it. There you go. Oh, three and one. Oh, that's lucky, man. That is the tactic that's you the... have to use in this. Yeah, it's like... Is to drop those guys when they come. No, you can't do it. Whoa! That was really lucky that yeah. you went down that ladder. Oh my god. Like, it's I think it's because you were over the ladder. Uh, you're, you're... I'm screwed, yeah. Oh god. Uh, but I'm not sure what I'm going to work on next. Please let me know if you find any issues. <sighs> None so far. No! Good game. Uh, except for that, you know, walking off the ladder thing, he doesn't clump down um, after, after I have a bit. to learn, like, some more tactics in this game, though. Like, oh. Like, see, like, I... Yeah. It's just, it's... There you go. That's the way to do it, man. Yep. It's the only way to do and lead it. Lead them to where you want them to go. Get get as much pepper as you can. Yeah, because it's like that's the only way. Don't go there. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's too many. It's on hard, your tail. It, but you got to do it at some point. I don't know how to like gracefully do those yet. The collision detection is very forgiving to allow the player to group the enemies onto burger patties. Poor egg there. Whoa. Oh, yeah. oh my god, that's just good. luck, that one. Holy yeah. shit. Whoa. There, that oh, was the right move, yeah. Fuck. I have to get this one, though. And, it, oh and, my god. Right, and it's just... It, it's hard, because now I have... I still have another, like, like... Like, so many dead ends to do. Let's see if that is the last level. Three, four, five, six... Yep. So that's the that's the only level you haven't conquered. Yeah, and like this is gonna take me a while, man, to figure this one out. This is I have to use you basically have to use all the tools at your disposal, it seems. This allows for a great deal of overlap until hit detection. Very rare in pixel death okay. twenty six hundred games. Me, man. They, all, they just come at you because there's these dead ends. This is a question I've wanted to ask for a while to the developers. Um, how many games use the built in um, collision detection versus games that use um, software collision detection? Do you know? Um, especially in these. Um... Whoa, they all went down the ladder. I don't know how that happened. That happened last game, too. Oh, I forgot the ladders are coming up, too. Damn it. Because um, I know in these flicker games, obviously, if the flicker is misaligned, or if you are in the same oh, flicker time as your enemy, you will never get collision detection in the hardware. Um, do you want to try this level? See if you can do it. It's hard, man. Andrew Davies says, I think once you use software collision detection, you never go back. That's what I, I think as well. Because um, the Atari 2600 actually has really, really good hardware collision detection. But there's a lot of complications yeah. that come in um, because of multiple um, sprite you know, flickering. And... But if one pixel overlaps another pixel in this, the Atari 2600 will let you know. Even one pixel. That's amazing. And I think on a lot of other systems, you have to have hitboxes, right? 
and then you just check if that hitbox intersects with that hitbox vertically and horizontally on the boundaries and it's a lot of so it's a lot to do especially in a 2600 yeah to do all those calculations so they figured you know build it into hardware um can you f uh, you want no i'll just play that last level because i've played yeah. this a lot let's see if we can conquer that one so how do i do it it's like game uh game select, select okay, until cool. we hit uh level six okay cool go ahead oh we have no camera it is hot in here isn't it no that was it anyway oh, let me fix the camera i can do that in a second. okay there we go. This one right. Good luck to me. And I'm dead already. Oh my god, they're so fast on this. Go down the ladder. Is this a safe zone? It is. <laughs> We're almost there. Yeah. I think this there we go. And then you have to zoom in. Oh, press the play button in the back. Oh yeah. Cool. So it Sorry, switches. Friends. Back on track. And then zoom in a bit. Too much. Oh. Way too much. Oh, There's hard. a delay. It's hard because I have to like... Back it off. A little okay, bit more. We're almost there. We're almost there, there you go. Yay! Okay. 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 <sighs> safe spot. This is like in Pac-Man. In Pac-Man there's a safe spot too. Oh, good. Because they are thinking it's better to go down the ladder uh, when they're coming up. I mean, I've got them in a loop now. That's but when to... they're coming up to, beside you, they're like, oh, going down the ladder is way better to get them. Yeah. Oh, Even though it's, it doesn't make any sense. That's perfect for when a now camera I'm... overheats. <laughs> it is. But now I'm in trouble. Now I'm in big trouble. Because I don't know what's going to happen here. Maybe I can lead them all over here. Yes! One by one, pick them off. Yeah, that's the way to do it, man. Yeah, it's uh, that's the, the thing is, is I was a bit too random with my choices. Like I was right. just trying to survive. This right. level, you need an approach. There's okay. no, there's no other way to do it. You need tactics. Yeah, you have to do it that way, and then it's a dead end. So you gotta yeah. pepper it, like. Yeah. The, and the thing Use is, man, you gotta wisely. do that. Like how many times? Like, cause you got, cause the top one, so you got to do many. one, oh two, three, God. four, five, and then you got to yeah. do four, and then three, and then two, and then one. So you got to do it like ten times, twenty times. So you, maybe you got to delay yourself. You got to do oh twenty God, dead ends, and then terrible. maybe get like those peppers. I mean, I think this is a. I think you got to be really methodical with this one, honestly. And do that kind of stuff. Yeah, oh my God. but then right, like it's like. Where they're gonna oh, appear again? Yeah, it fell a couple. Yeah, that was the tactic somebody said. Is like if you uh, get them on it, you do. Do they drop more? They do. Okay, yeah. then that's the only way to fucking do this. Because not only will that keep you alive, <laughs> but it'll save you time. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm running out of pepper. Yeah, this Badly. is like a pepper level. It's just... <laughs> it is a pepper level. Ah! <laughs> it's like trying to eat like. Oh, and then I, there's a pepper. Oh. It's like trying to eat Indian food without rice, you know? Yeah, there's just nothing so to. You can't. You just nothing gonna, to calm it down you, with. You're just gonna eat curry. <laughs> like that's what it's like with like, trying to play this game without pepper. You're done. <laughs> it is. <laughs> and I don't have any pepper left. Oh my god! I'm. Whoa! I'm okay, lucky, dead? I was lucky, very lucky. lucky. Now I would almost like st like rotate around until a pepper comes. You know, like don't go yeah, into a don't yeah, go into yeah, a yeah. dead end until because that's the thing I think actually in this one you're wise to just move around a bunch and until you have like um, them properly trained. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! You can lead them exactly, and then go for the dead end. Like I think a dead end's got to be really strategic. Yeah, because there you go. You got another pepper potentially. It, but, oh, you'll get it. No doubt you'll get it. So now you can like for sure maybe go maybe do like the top do left one, one right? Because yeah. it's because yeah. Still trying to do the tactics, but there's always going to be that guy that's lagging behind. That's why you got to get the pepper right. So like right now you got a free one, so you I can do. totally nail this one. But I think you got to basically like wait for another pepper to come up and yeah. keep training these guys. Yeah, because there you go, it will come, and the and then you got to be strategic about when you when you go for it. Oh yeah, that's like, not a bad idea. I needed two there. Yeah, it's, you had to, but it's tough, Do I have man. one more life? You got one more life, oh, man. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. And you got one more pepper, so it's possible, man. It's more than possible. But I would train them. Like, I wouldn't... Uh... Uh, I'm dead. Oh, my Not God. A terrible move. Oh, yeah, you are. So close. 
Okay, I think I think I can do it now. Yeah, thrust says um, working from top to bottom seems like the best strategy. Oh, I agree. You're man, wasting definitely. your time if you don't do that. You're wasting your time because you still have to put those burgers down. Oh my god! Always do top to bottom if you can. Yeah, now get that one on the left, right, because right. it's free. So like, if you ever see the chance to get those dead ends, Always. get them immediately. I might have even gone for it then, because, you know, like, right now he's just crazy. It is crazy. Um, but, like, yeah, oh, bam, good. Bam! There we go. Let's just get this done. Yeah. Let's get that done. But if you ever see opportunity to get, like, one oh, of those yeah. dead-end ones, you got to get them, because, like, this one here, like this I bet one? you you can get. Yep. Um, it's going to be tight, but you can do it, and that's, like, necessary. Get oh, and okay. get and that. Another pepper. And you kind of got them nicely trained now, actually. Yeah, they're clumping. I might go to that top want. right one, actually. Oh, I'm gonna... See, because you got an opportunity to. Oh, you know, knock them, knock them down. Yeah, with yep. that. Fuck. Wow. Damn it. Whoa. See, that's that's that's, that's how they get you, right? Yep. But you got a pepper. Oh, and I got two of them. Good. 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 Let's. Oh. Whoa. Yeah, you went for it, which is cool. Yeah, that was risky. But... Yeah, so that one's good. Okay, let's do this. Oh, Whoa. nice. Nice. Whoa. Okay, yeah. Nice, that was a freebie. Well, you gotta get that pepper, man. Uh, damn it. You gotta, yeah, oh you gotta use one to get one. Oh my god. Just, yeah, you're gonna die, so just like, get that done. Whoa. Yeah, there's pepper. Oh. oh god. Now what? I'm then just get one of those dead ends, man. Yeah. Oh, or, or, or train oh, these guys. Either or. I still have three, two lives. I yeah. just want to get you, it. When I just want to complete this level. Yeah, you don't get any new pepper. Okay. That's tough. No. Oh, no, you don't. I thought you got new pepper for some reason. Yeah, you got to oh. basically not go for any dead ends. Farm the pepper. And farm pepper for a bit, man. <laughs> just don't, don't go into those dead ends. It'll pop up. And try to train these guys if you can. No. Oh no. Whoa. Ooh. That was. Please go somewhere else. Damn it. Yeah, you got him, but. I mean, it's possible, man. It's it's, it's very possible. Cause... Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> we should move on, because what time <laughs> yeah. is it? We're like. We're getting there. Yeah. Getting there. So, oh my God. Amazing. Amazing. It's such a good amazing game, game, dude. Holy shit. Um, so the winner yeah. of our poll, uh, which is I three. thought <laughs> is number three with 83.3%. Overwhelming. There are some people who are like, I like games with no flicker at all, which makes a lot of sense. They're very clean. Yeah, man. And it adds a, a little bit of a uh, challenge to create those games. And nobody wanted tons and tons of flicker as you did. <laughs> and uh, some people are okay with a tiny bit of, uh, yeah. a bit of flicker. So. Um, so the next game we're going to be playing is uh, uh, Sud Sudo. Oh my god. Sokobu. Keep saying yeah. uh, Sokoban, but it's not Sokoban, and I will explain why it's not Sokoban. You're not chewing, are you? No, no. I was just, I had my fucking eyes on him, man. Atari yeah. was just about to put his, oh, buddy. Oh, he's get a big sniff of something. What happened? You got some catnip going on? <laughs> it's Look, by Andrew... That looked like a catnip face, if I've ever seen yeah, one. That's when they do the big sniff. Uh, uh, humans have lost that extra ability to yeah. do that uh, extra smells. Yeah, um, but a lot of uh, mammals can still do that, and that's that face they make. It's like extra whoa. Yeah, ours have closed off. We can't smell it, that kind of stuff that's anymore. Like, that's like getting the throwing sword power. <laughs> so we're gonna have to do this on the Stella. Okay, cool. So we're gonna swap positions. Uh, yeah, get it set up first though, because it's, yeah. it's always it always takes a bit a bit of time to. And this by oh, let's not click on whatever that does. Okay, TV device. Yeah, man. Input. There we go. Let's get Stella up and going, which I already have ready. There we go. Select ROM from playlist. 
Well, they're probably not seeing this yet. Not yet. They cool. will in about one second. Oh, they don't want to see. Oh, they won't yet. I have to get into the game and get everything ready. Because things will be bad. Whoa. If I don't. There we go. <laughs> so, uh, we're going to use a keyboard, which means we're going to swap positions while Sick. you play. Is this the one that's like the puzzle game? Yes, it oh. is. I don't think you played this. I think I did, actually. Maybe. There you go. It's just uh, space bar up, down, left, right. And uh, we'll get to the programming. Oh my god. One second. We're going to turn down the volume. Mike, there we go. Yeah, that, sound, that sounds good. There. Oh, we got a guy. That's like, okay. So See if I can turn it up. There we go. Oh, I think that's too loud for them. Too loud still. There we go. Sorry, everybody. Just adjusting. Uh, the colors are correct on both. Oh, yeah, man. Last time it wasn't a guy pushing in. I think... Or was it? Oh, he says the... Oh, looks like PAL. Switch the right difficulty to A and restart. That looks like PAL. Colors are correct on both. Music is great. Can you please switch to NTSC? Okay. Okay, okay. Sorry. Uh, now, what is that key command? Oh, not that. Oh, let's not do that. What is it? Tab. Tab. Okay, we'll do that. Oh, I need the mouse, please. Oh, sorry. Or I don't need the mouse, but it just makes There's it easier. Your, your power is all back. Uh, video. Is it video? No, it's not video. Well, it is says it? NTSC and stuff there, but I don't know if that's right. Oh, it's aspect. No, no. So that doesn't relate. F7. Yes, that's what I wanted. There we go. Is that is that better? Is that right now? Yeah, that's better now. It's okay. I can redo the first few levels. They were not. Why are you playing on Stella for this one? Well, we will tell you. Um, it's because... Oh, and I haven't changed the graphic either. Oh, okay. okay. Cool. One second. People I am playing on Stella because this uses a bank switching technique that is not supported on the Harmony Encore cart. Uh, it is supported on the Uno cart, but my Uno cart does not work properly yet with my RGB modded 6 switch. <laughs> <laughs> so therefore, the only thing left over to show it off at the moment is Stella, which does a great job. Oh, dude, so there's moves. There's a number of moves. Yes, there's a so number of moves. that's a way to sort of measure it. And there's also take back with the space bar if you make a mistake. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. Okay, that's going to be useful. I need to close Stella and restart. Oh, boy. Okay, okay. Well, we want to show it off properly, right? Yeah, absolutely, man. So you get to see your own chat for a second. <laughs> your faces. Andrew Davey. Who is the programmer for this? We'll see. Oh, you get to see all my games. Uh, so I get to go to Sokobu. Look at all the builds. <laughs> there you go. Is that right now? I hope so. Please let me know, because the get the the colors are still a bit crazy. Oh yeah. Is that better? Um... So you have to use the game properties. Nope. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, we're going to fix this. This is our journey today. This is our fight. Yeah. Oh. Damn it. What just happened? Oh, is it options, game properties, or something like that? I don't know. What just happened? Did I delete it? What is happening here? Whoa. Well. 
Oh no! What did what did I? How did I? How's that how, possible? How did they all disappear? What did I go to? Oh, the filter. Yay! Okay, cool. Okay, so um, power on options. Uh, TV type. Nope. Nope. Startup mode. Nope. 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 Is it left or right difficulty? Is that no? It needs to be launched in A, right? Options. Oh. I think that's it. Um, mm -hmm. Game properties. Yes, that's where it is. Format. NTSC. Right? I feel like that's right. Let's see. This is going to... Uh-oh. <laughs> Friends, are you seeing what we're seeing? <laughs> oh, yeah. They're seeing exactly what we're okay. seeing. Okay. He says no. <laughs> no. I don't know if that's no you're not seeing or you know. <laughs> what was this at? Oh no no. I doubt the bank is gonna make a difference. Auto detect. Actually let's open it up and let's see what is actually being detected. It's r rocking seventy five. It's got the right bank. It's saying NTSC. But I don't think it is NTSC that it's being forced to. You need to have the right switch on A when Stella powers up. Oh, you guys in PAL territories. Okay. Okay, when, so, when, when Stella powers up. So that's like, so we close and then... Console... Right difficulty on A. How about that? We're going to force it. And that should make it work now. Hooray! Is that, is that right, friends? There we go. That. I'm pretty sure it's right. Okay, okay. Give me a big yes! Splendid Nut says yes! I want to... Oh, he's probably knows from the music. It's going nuts. Like the, the and music... restart Stella. And restart Stella. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Sorry, friends. We're that close. We're, We're that close. Yes, okay. The dream is almost alive. Of a Soku Ball. No need to restart Stella. <laughs> well, we did anyway. We did. And it should retain all that info. Everybody gets a good look at all the games. I it's have. not a... It's like the oldest IT thing in the book. It's like, you know, why not? Stuff. Looks good to me. It says yeah. NTSC. There's a scaling issue with Stella. Okay. Well, you can see everything. Yeah, man. It's not cutting off. It's actually really good. Yeah, it's not okay. cutting off. It should be the right aspect as well. That looks we're okay. Very, we're okay, very thanks. sensitive to aspect ratios. <laughs> and, very. <laughs> and pixels being cut off, so we totally understand. And we do want to represent your game perfectly. Hell yeah, man. Thanks for also giving us his tips for future. Now, so, yeah. in this game, I want to start off um, by showing you how he's drawing this game. Yeah. And you get a good example um, on the level screen. Does the level screen stay, or are you pressing the button to advance? Oh, let's, let's see. Yeah, like, stop pressing the button if it is. Okay. Don't press any buttons. Okay, it doesn't. Anyway, um, take a look at the screen here of uh, the blocks, the, um, the dirt, um, and the everything on the screen, except for the, except for the guy. Um, and it's all drawn, if I'm not uh, mistaken, because I did look at, you know, the, um, you know, that, that view that you can see what everything is used with. It's all done with the play field, but it's he does something it's called interleaved chrono color that he has uh, termed. Dude, I'm into this. Into <laughs> so, what he is doing is very similar to what CR how CRTs draw, but he's blown it up so you can actually physically see it, but your eyes kind of adjust to it so that things are different colors. But if you can see, he's divided up the drawing into three lines. On this screen, it's a blue an orange and a purple uh, on you know the bricks around around the side 
So if he wants it to be a certain color, he will draw either the blue, the, the purple, oh. or the orange. Or nothing. Um, and that results in a possibility of eight colors. I don't know all the keys for Stoa. I know some of them. I don't know pause. That would be really good. What's pause? <laughs> you can't tell me I can pause Stella, but not tell me what how to pause it. Um, oh, the scan lines aren't quite the same size. Yeah. But anyway, he is able to achieve uh, a, a kind of a blown up look to the game, but also to achieve a lot of different colors with the play field by using single line drawing and either turning them off or turning them on. Um, being able to do the CRT, red, green, blue yeah. technique. But he's not using red, green, blue. He's using whatever he wants for each of the levels. And it's, oh, the pause key. <laughs> so we will do that when we get to the, uh, and you'll see it on the uh, the level screen a lot easier. Of course, it gets harder and harder <laughs> as you're playing. So I'm gonna read off uh, a bunch of notes. And also I wanna commend uh, Andrew Davey for releasing the source code for his game as he's going along once in a while. Uh, and he says, um, I wanted I wanted you to acknowledge Nostalgia Nostalgy uh, 37 for his work on the sprites, which uh, last time we played it, I, there wasn't a guy there. And if you take a look at him, and if you don't if you don't move, he starts getting impatient. That's starts cool. Starts tapping his foot, looks around, blinks. He's, yeah, he goes, to, me? I'm just trying to wrap my head around this one. I could just jump in and do it, but I'm just trying yeah, to think about like... It's not what? always a great idea. No. Because you don't want to trap yourself. And you don't want to push a, a block against a wall. But yeah, the I animation know, is beautiful. I think I know what we're going to do. Um, his methods are old-fashioned, uh, and he's making more work for himself than he could if he modernized a bit. But the, the results, in my view, are fantastic. Yeah, the... The look, and when he pushes too, and he goes, "Yay, yay!" Okay, <laughs> perfect timing, I think. Yeah, he finished way quicker than I thought. And I missed it, but anyway, you can see it. Yeah, Boulder Dash style. Yeah, and and also he changes the color, but we'll get to that. Um, and he says, uh, "Nostalgia 37 uses Microsoft Paint and hand animation and drawings, as far as I know." In any case, the resultant frames require a bit of manip manipulation to fix up the palettes and get the uh, size correct. And the colors on the guy are great. Like, uh, he's very smart in using um, transparency for the hair. So the hair is black against the black background. Um, and the pants and the shoes and the hands are at the right level with the belt. So his belt is kind of uh, one color, the same color as his hands. Um, but like I said, he's doing a fine job and it's important to me that his contribution is acknowledged and it is rightly so acknowledged. There you go. So you can see there how the three colors, they're not really, it's just kind of a blown up version of it, but yeah. he's using interlaced colors to, this is a full spectrum version of it. That's cool. Yeah, but he's alternating the colors each line and you'll be able to see it in the gameplay here where you can see all the background why am i standing up nobody can see me standing up um, the background is all green because he's just drawing the green lines but when it gets into the brick he's only drawing the green lines in certain spots and the orange in certain spots and it's it's really really smart really brilliant oh nostalgia 37 also did the sprites in chaotic grill oh, wow. got a theme today uh, likewise, the music has been done for me by Citrix. He's a fine musician and quite famous in retro music sound communities. It's my great honor to be working with him uh, for sound on this game. The refined sounds are being worked on, and for now you get a full blast, a very very smart, small part of the backing tune. But the final game will have subtle backing tunes, sound effects, and a bit of humor thrown in. Can't wait. So that's very exciting. Okay, this post is where it's gonna get unlucky, man. We're oh, it gets hard. Level thirteen. But he has adjusted the uh, difficulty. Can quite... you? Can I look? Is there a way to look? Oh yes, you hold down the space bar. 
no. and then move around. Oh, okay, that's good. Yeah, sorry I didn't mention that. We haven't no, got into the how to how to play the game yet. It's no, it's no issue. I just, just trying and it's brilliant because the the screens get really big after a bit. So that's a carryover from Boulder Dash as well. Um, press select to select the levels. There are 153 levels installed. Whoa. And that's what you need with puzzle games like this. Because they, they are long term. You want to. Okay, I made it to level 13. I think I have an idea. Yeah, some of them require to be pushed around a little bit more than others. Uh, you know, like. Yes, and then you go around that one. I do that. There you go. And then I kind of like do that. Push that one in, and you got it. And I think Andrew Davies got. Um, it's a nicer ramp. I think we played it before. And it was, was like brutal. Like fucking really. Level hard. three was like you're done. Yeah, was you're like, done was on like level so, three. So is like rip immediately. So Andrew's adjusted the level ramping a lot better now. Like you're, we never would have made it to level thirteen without like some serious dedication before. I think that one goes to the right, and then you push that one up, but and then you. I think so. And then you can get around. And there's not a, not many moves actually because you can't push that one to the right because that one's done for sure uh that one would go down and then uh, to the right i think i'm gonna like do this first yeah it's no harm because i think that like i think that all i need to do now is oh like, yeah no you can do the bottom one first like or either that, way and then yeah, you're like good bam. Uh, it's cool because like if you with the with the move counter, it's like if I got really like aggro about it, you could try to find like the easiest way to do it. You know? Yeah. Oh, I forgot to talk about. Okay, this first posted July fourteenth, and it's now uh, this builds like today, hours old. He he sent this in to me just before the show. Uh, it's a thirty two k game. Other games that Andrew has made: AA Holiday Cart, Atari Age Holiday Cart, two thousand three, two thousand four, uh, the Atari Age Xmas. Greeting cart, Boulder Dash, QB, uh, Sokoban, Sokobu, it's been renamed. I need to correct that. Sokobu, and we'll get to that as well. Plus a bunch of C64, NES, and SNES games. You can download this exact game in the forums right now. Uh, we last played on July 31st, 2019, so I thought it was time for an update. So his update on August 6th, uh, the version is now format switchable via the right difficulty switch. A lot more convenient when you're actually using real hardware as opposed to Stella. Uh, a is NTSC, B is PAL. Uh, he's defaulted. He's defaulted to the PAL because he, he comes from a PAL territory. So makes sense for him. <laughs> Throws us off in North America. Uh, Thrust asks if there's still space left. Um, reset to restart the level. The button to, to press the button to for a take back. You haven't had to do that yet. No, have you? not yet. You've been kicking ass. Difficulty be, can be measured more by uh, measured by moves and pushes. Yeah, definitely. Totally. The more moves you have to do, um, the more difficult it is. Uh, on August sixth, he's added he added a thirty four levels. He included the source code, which is really great um, for people who want to make um, games. I haven't looked at the source code. I'm guessing. Oh no, signal! It's too hot in here. Oh God! So I don't know what we're gonna do. Did you? I'm just gonna have to live through it, guys. Power through it till I get the new camera, which is coming soon. I think. I, I think, think so too, man. That. Yeah, because you just need a body. That's all yeah. you need. You've already got all the stuff, and that and the, the yeah, because we got the cam. My camera ran the, the twelve hours. Oh yeah, so I, and it was hot, hot, and that was like hot. how many people were in here? It Four was... people, and it was hot, and all the lights were on for twelve hours, and it didn't. Blink. No, it didn't blink. So do you want to? Do you want to try out this puzzle? No, I'm not able. I got lots of reading. Okay, to do. cool. I'll keep working. You can. It. You I'll can go it. forward one by the game select if you cool. want to give up. I'll figure it out. I just want to get through all the, oh, uh, good, good the talking. Uh, bu 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 interesting. I don't need a game over screen or sequence because you never die. What if they defeat all the levels, every single level you put in there? Maybe you can make a big sprite of the guy going, yeah, yeah, full screen sprite. See, the hard part about this one is I'm seeing nothing but, like, dead ends. Mm. But uh, there is for sure a way. I'm just trying to think about, like, what it is. <laughs> Kev73 says, summer. Feels bad, man. Yeah, hot summers. It's just warm here. And the camera 
is not a video camera. It's a still camera I that too, takes video. I think we've also been maybe like pushing it like crazy for the last could year. Be. It could be a little, little sensitive now to heat. Yeah. Uh, August 8th, can't stop fiddling. There's sync. Do you want me to go ahead at one? Or? No, I'm just trying to wrap oh, okay. my brain around this. I'll figure it out. So his to-do on August 8th was take back, which he implemented, low score table for each screen. That would be very cool. A selection of screen to play. Uh, I think you got selection done. Indication if you beat the low score for a screen. Very good. Ooh. Save key function, of course, to save all those low scores. Man animations, which he's got done. Sound, music updates. Uh, no sound yet. When you push, push something, is there any sound? No, not really. I don't yeah. think so. I mean... No. Uh, add more levels. He's aiming for 256 question mark and end of level pizzazz, which he has got done now. He's got some uh, game select. Oh, the game select works differently. Yes, you can actually manually select it with the up, down, left, right kind of thing. Ugh. Yeah. It's done. Uh, yeah, you're done. You can push that one down and push that one over, but then it's but then done. Then it's rip, yeah. Yeah. Right, want me to reset? Yeah, let's reset. Or not. Or oh, oh yeah, no, we're on Stella, so we gotta. Oh, we gotta keep forgetting. What's the reset button? Or you can just do take back to the right, right to the beginning. Or not? Okay, oh, spacebar is look, but like. Oh, I thought it was. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And it actually physically removes the numbers. Oh, there we go. Three, two, one. There we go. Zero. And a big red flash when it's like, no, you're back at the beginning, which is smart to let you know. Um, and then uh, Nostalgia 37 posted, Is it just me or Sokobu, a strange sounding name for a game? It does sound very Japanese. Sokobu, it does, Sokobu yeah. like a B-U, but it's a Soko B-O-O. -O. Wouldn't something like Shove Off be more apropos? I'm aware there is an American version for a vintage system with a similar title. Uh, the original game was called Sokoban. All my close friends and family call me Boo. It's a play on names, so therefore that's why it's called Sokobu now. Um, Andrew Davey posted something really interesting. The asynchronous multitasking nature on August 10th of the tile engine means that things happen when they can rather than when they're called. This shows up in the initial screen draw when you see a kind of draw happening as the initial titles are drawn on the screen, which is mind boggling to me that he draws the screen not all at once. He draws it as... He figures out the game field, which is on a 2600 is mind blowing. But that's kind of the same thing that happened in Boulder Dash when he has like a stack of things that need to be done. Yeah. So it sounds like he's implemented that stack again in this game. Oh, he's but for he, drawing. He's like, yeah, let's skip this level because I'm fucking, I can't think, I can't figure it out. Uh, I mean, it's it the switch. function keys, I believe it's F1? Yes. So... 16? You can try and see if it's the same one. It's the same one, right? Yeah. So you go to 17. So change. Up, down, left, right. There you go. Um, it's tough because puzzle games are tough for the show. They are, but... They're, it, yeah. but they're, they're good games, but... But visually... It's just like engagement is tough. Yeah, staring at me trying to figure <laughs> it out. Is... Because there's a lot of nothing happens in in puzzle games. That's the thing. Yeah, you need to like you need to think about this stuff. You know, it's not. Yeah. Uh oh, and I'll jump to this one. I've implemented this pretty weird concept called ethnicity, where the player comes in all races, colors, lifestyle choices, and sense of clothing Yay! style. Millennials like you. Yeah. So this guy is a purple guy. Oh. You're, you're... Good. Oh no, you're not good. No, it's fucked. I gotta think about it. Oh boy, how do you get to that one in there? I know, that's the... That's the rub. <laughs> uh... Hmm, tough one. Uh, this way the system works as the colors are translated on the fly. This is the only way I can reasonably have many animation frames both independently and colored and NTSC compile compatible. So at each fr every frame, the system looks up the color conversions for the frame, and because it does this, it allows me to have selectable color configurations at runtime. So in this binary, I just cycle at each level between four ethnicities that I, ethnicities that I have installed so far. They're not making any statements or assumption about stereotypes. They're just colors that looked okay on a first pass. Eventually in the game, I hope to be let you choose which one you play with. 
So yeah, you could have that on the title screen. Go left, right, and choose the look of the guy. You could go left, right for skin color and up, down for outfit. And then spacebar to start. That'd be really cool. And this is the re first release version with Nostalgia 37's animation and sprites. I've added a few minor frames here and there, but kept the basic look and feel. Of course, the player won't be moving around like a hot potato in the final version. At the moment, he's just showing off his full range of movements. Okay. Uh, here's another version. Uh, remember, next level equals select, restart, re level equals reset. Press button for tape back, hold button for look around, and a level screen display. Very cool. I completely redone the colors. Um, sample videos show a PAL and NTSC version. Let's go through the first five levels. And then um, f last Friday, he updated the sprite animation frames a bunch. Uh, a, and he needed to decouple the game frame rate from the movement animation frame rate. Oh, so he was going super crazy, I guess, in that last one. This engine could be used for tons of board game and strategy games. It would be interesting to see if anyone else uses now. The source has been released. That's a very a good point. Like, this can be used for... A lot of things because the way the background is done and the character is done it looks like he's only used one player character so you have one player you have an extra player character free and also a lot of flexibility say you can make water you can make land you can make mountains with this I mean it's a lot more blown up than other RPGs that have been made, but it uses the full screen. And plus he's implemented a look around as well. So you can look around without having to move there, which is a big advantage in RPGs. Um, and you've got a top screen there for stats. The engine can handle two players. Well, there we go. It's already built in. That's amazing. Uh, Milton Buddhist, I can see some Ultima type games in this. Yeah, man. Yeah, definitely. RPGs would would work really well and you've already implemented pushing things around in this which which would be amazing in an rpg if you have to like push a boulder aside to get somewhere hell yeah um how do i get this guy man this is a nightmare <laughs> i'm trying to figure this out i feel so dumb i felt like a genius level let's see, one to let's see, let's see, 14 let's see. now i'm like Oh no! Like I just—I so was like, "Oh, push the bottom one aside." Oh, you have to get there first. That's the tricky part, right? Oh. So like, and then it's like, "Oh, but now that one's in the way." I mean, that's an option, but the all the way to the top, but you then you're screwed that one well, at the top. May, may that's probably no, you have. Cause yeah, because you can't you, you can't, can't get push it back. It. So yeah, that's definitely not the way. Yeah. You have to press, press, press. Oh, I have 27 levels in. Let's reset. <laughs> I love it counts up when you do a reset. Oh, there's a mouse there. Get out of here, mouse. Oh, interesting. Yeah, so you have this to do this. This is the beginning. You have to do you this You have to do one. that one. And now it's like, you gotta... And if, hold on, spacebar, you can see the whole thing. Yeah. yeah oh, I'll bitty. switch it over. Bitty, there we go. This bitty. So you can reposition it. It doesn't reset after. Yeah, that's which is awesome. really nice. Push all but the second down to the right. Okay, let's do that. Okay. No, that's the second, I think. Yeah, all, all but the all second. All but the second, all the way to the right. All the way to the right. Oh. No. What? Oh. 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 No. No, it's not. No? No. Because you got you to deal with that one on the right now. Well, let's do this. Ah. Let's do this. But but see, the issue here is oh, you no. can't... You can't do anything with the one on the far right, eh? That's the problem. Damn it. Not all the way. <laughs> Not all the way. Just... Okay, so just one to the right, I think. did say all the way. <laughs> all but the second one. Okay, so... Look, go so like that one. one. Just one. And then, just one. I yeah, won't push two. that one all the way. And then three. Okay, now let's think about, like... Okay. He said all of them. Um, and then I think what I have to do is move that oh, out of the way. down, and then down, down, and then there you go. Oh, yeah. Fuck. Thank you. Oh, my God. It's not obvious. Well, that's the thing. That's why these games are... This bit, is a, it is a little sensitive. Have yeah. you found that? Or he goes moves two? Yeah. Like there. It's tough. He's moving two really... 
So it needs a bit of a debounce there. Is that the right terminology? <laughs> I've never programmed. Yeah. Uh, that kind of stuff. Yeah. A little bit of a, a delay there, I think it needs. There we go. Yay! It, yeah, and this is a tough game for the show just because it's like, you know, if I'm killing... <laughs> a lot of pausing and thinking. Well, yeah, if I'm killing it, it's good, but like, when am uh, I ever killing it? So, high scores... So his to-do list now is high score saved on the save key and displayed in some sort of tabular form. A congratulations screen when you beat a previous score for that level, so a special thing. Maybe a tune, a little flash. A level selection, press up, down to change by 10. Oh, you've already done that, so you've implemented that. And finalize the sounds. So he's getting really close. Like, those are not big, big, big things. Uh, today, post I've restored the pushing the tar pulsing target, which is great. Those look great. So you can see what is needed to be pushed onto. I think the general feedback was positive, so it's in the current build. Oh, for sure, those look great. And it's not fast and distracting and flashy. I implemented your excellent suggestion regarding the use of reset select and how the selection screen should work. But I think it's working as you described. Yeah, that's working great. I did suggest it. I don't know who he's referring to. I think he's replying to somebody. Uh, here's the latest binder. I think it might be the one reviewed on Zero Page Homebrew in a few hours. Yes. It is. So. I don't think. Don't think you can I don't get think it. I figured it out. No, you're done. Well, that's fine. We're Great. good. We're Kay. good. We're good. Okay, sit. And, oh, and the screen's got the. Oh, port. no. Our ca Camera. Maybe I can put my hand on it, heal it. Heal Give it, it a, a moment. Bit, take some heat away from it. So move back over. Oh, yeah. There's only, and there's only so much you can do, but. Oh, it's sit. really hot. Yeah, man. Put some ice on it. In the early days, they used to do that with cameras. Ice? Yeah, you you don't you put oh. it in a plastic bag so you don't want any oh. water touching it. The early Red One, the first build of it, um, Soderbergh shot this movie called Che in the yeah. middle of the jungle, and they had like the they had non-stop um, plastic oh, bags with jungle. ice because they just it was too hot. It just overheated all the time. And then the problem with that too is if you get a fan going, well then you can't like use the sound of your shot. So yeah, so it's uh, ice. Ice it is then. Ice is a legit thing, but then you got to be super careful and like get water on a camera because that's the <laughs> worst possible thing. Oh yeah, that's it's game over with water. Skyrim twenty six hundred. I missed all this chat. That's great. Oh no, Skyrim. Yeah, Skyrim twenty six hundred. Open world. There we go. Okay, we are back. The, the Dragonborn. So that... Born 8-bit. <laughs> uh, yeah. The shout is just like a, a single ball. Just... So obviously, awesome. Really good, man. Awesome game. Um, uh, the way it's been implemented is really, really good. The graphics are amazing. That's the kind of thing I would just like, you know, on like a Saturday afternoon, you just yeah. open it up and all of a sudden, like two hours go by and you've just been staring at your screen trying to figure out all these puzzles. And it's and it's great that you can end on a level and then come back to it later. Hell yeah. And and you have... And skip it. It's kind of like doing a multiple choice test. It's like if you don't know the answer, you can keep going. And then when you come back, you go, oh, I got some new ideas. And, you know, when you when you buy it, you have 256 level. It's, it's crazy. A, it's a long-term purchase. Like, you're going to be good for a long time if you love those type of games. And there's some people out there who just, oh my God. that's what they do. Well, like just puzzles all the time. I'd say, like, I got through 15, and then I was like, okay, now i got to, like, stare at this for, like, 20 minutes for each level. So if there's yeah. 256 levels, that's some serious, you know, time, depending on how good you are at these. Oh, yeah. Oh, and Kev made a terrible joke. He said, you should look at the end level, say 153. <laughs> ah! He's, he's right. But it's annoying because we have okay. to change it. But we're not okay. annoyed with you. We're annoyed with ourselves. The, the setup that we have to go through again. It's just it's only because of the Stella stuff. But we will do it. It's a terrific suggestion, man. We, yeah, of course. We, I want to see it. So I'll get it set up and and jump to that. Oh. 153, man. Oh, does it not have skip by 10? No, it's just up by 1. I think just hold it down, that's going to yeah, be the fastest. Yeah, we'll get there fastest, fast enough. Um, so let me put that back up on the screen. Oh, fuck. One second. Where is it? Oh, there we go. Now I can switch over. 
and I'll put the proper graphic up for it. Silco Boo. There's your chat. Not anymore. One fifty-three. One? He says, "Yeah, let's do one fifty-three." Okay. Almost there. One, two, three. <sighs> Let me put the music on. Adventure. Again. Dun, 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 dun. Whoa. Oh, okay, let's, let's look around. Let's look around at this shit. Holy oh, fuck. Nightmare world. Okay, okay. Well, the good thing is that you have no choice at first. You have to do that. And then probably got to do, do it that. again. Now it opens up. And now is where and we now fail. we got to look at it. You know, like, let's look at this whole puzzle real quick. Okay, so we got to wrap around the top, I bet. Oh, oh, no, no, not necessarily. No so these three here, you can't get them trapped. Um, so I can push that one up one and still be fine. But I can't push that one up to the left of me one because it's done. Uh, I have to go in there now. Yeah. And then I have to go in again because there's no Holy option. Holy shit. And now it's just wide open. And this, this is where I die. <laughs> See, this is where you need to do 152 like, levels to earn oh, the right yeah. to even begin to wrap your brain around to this. To know all this, the the tactics. The tricks and wrap your, you know. It's like how to get that one, you get that one first. And... This is almost like you get a pen and paper out and you map it out and you just try to th work through it almost. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have to work backwards yeah. a bit because you know where they all end up. So you, actually, you, you try and meet in the middle, I think, yeah. is, is the strategy. Um, it would, dude. This level's driving me to drink, and I'm, <laughs> we haven't even started it. Yeah, so that's that's for experts. I think we'll leave that one to the experts. Yeah, but obviously, an amazing legendary game. setting. Oh yeah, amazing, amazing, amazing game. How many and moves are required here, Andrew Davy? Good question, Thrust. That is that a is very that good is question. the question. Probably more than one hundred and fifty-three. He said about 3,000, I'd guess. That sounds like a lot. Holy <laughs> shit. Atari Vox. And we'll be getting a new Atari Vox at PRGE. Oh, shit. So we can finally play Wizard of War in its full glory with all the, the, the sounds. New camera, new... Oh, new everything, yeah. It's going to be good. Yeah, just have to have, wait for one more thing before to, That's right. to get that camera. We, we almost were... We're, we're almost at on that a, point. We're working on a project, on and... Man, it's going slow. It is, man. <laughs> but we'll get there. Projects are fun, but okay, we're gonna be playing Dragon's <sighs> Descent by Revan Tuli. Oh, I'm excited. Okay, unfortunately, anything I don't with, think he's here. Did today. anything with Dragon in the title? I'm in. Yep. This was first posted December 14th, 2018. This build is from August 15th, a couple of weeks ago. It's 16k game. Other games he's made: Dragon Racer, Trials of the Worm, Ooh. Dragons, and Dragon's Descent. I like that it's just both a, a, a maze and what do you call those codes? QR those code. QR code, yeah. With a dragon in the center. Oh, don't press anything. They haven't seen it yet. Oh, sorry, uh, friends. That's okay. There we go. Yeah, very, very <coughs> cool that title screen. Away. Like, um, all made out of Playfield. But I love it's it. like really, really great design. Uh, Andrew Davey, OK, 6 a.m. Thank you guys for your review. I need to go to sleep. Yes, Yeah, we thanks do. so much. Oh, for... Revan Tooley is here. Welcome. Revan, stop, we, dude. We have four for four. That's amazing. Four for four. I, I don't know. Of developers you, for the games. You, I don't know if you've been here the whole time, but my main thing is I love your graphic. I like your, oh, like yeah. your cover graphic. Yeah. This is, and you have not played this. I've never played this before. OK, that's going to be fun then. Um, we last played it uh, two weeks after it was released. On December 28th, 2018. It Ooh. is time for an update. It's been eight yes. months. Um, we'll see how the session goes in terms of gameplay. I'm working on the instruction manual right now. Because he's pretty close. Like, this is really close. That's to great to know, man. Um, I'm going to get a map. Okay, cool. Or start a map. Um, we'll see who who, who, who who comes out on top when playing what. But we'll, Sounds good. We'll trade off. Yeah, we'll figure first. it out because that's always, you know, sometimes... Because it's not really an RPG... It's more action, it's but it's mazy as well. I'm noticing with me, it's weird. It's random. Like some games, I'm like, oh my god, and then some games, <laughs> it's just that it's hard to know which will be which until we jump in. Um, Paper. Yay! Too bad about our camera, but it's, yeah, sorry guys. It's, it's just gonna cut out for a bit here, and until it gets cooler outside. Yeah, and it will. It it's will. the summer's pretty much over. 
So let's press the button. And this is level one. I know there are harder levels. There's a randomization level. Am I a dragon? You play a dragon. Yes. In this. Oh, I was gonna Usually joke have to about fight that. Dragons, but this one you play a dragon. Okay, I'm gonna go into the thing and see. If... Dragons. Okay. Well, okay, I can't touch the edge. No, that's Whoa. what makes this game challenging. Okay. And, and it's like slippery. It feels like we're on like acceleration. And slow Whoa, down because okay. he's flying, right? I got he's a got hard. A... That gives you different things uh, depending on what you get. I usually Whoa, get the heart. What's this? It's just points. I've totally forgotten what everything is. Oh, I can't I do shoot down. No. Oh, that yeah. changes everything. Yeah. Okay. Great. So those are your lives on the right. Great. And. Whoa. Okay. Some things take more than one shot. Oh, I was getting cocky. Okay, so like weird okay so get it when it's a heart no that was a diamond shit and he gave you points i, should, I thought it was i thought that was a heart <laughs> uh, you definitely want a heart because it gives you extra lives i believe yeah that's definitely lamp is more do. firepower heart is more life which i like gem is more score avoid the gem we're not going for score okay. some things take more than two shots so don't get too close wild those things head for <gasps> you there you go yeah that gave you nothing that's okay. Because you're max out lives, I think. Maybe. Just one life? Yeah. A lot of my time is working on the 7800 whoa, version. Whoa, oh, whoa. okay. Oh, no. Yeah, the cats, those things. They look like Holy cats to me cow. for some reason. So you have to find the key. The thing is, in this game... Whoa. Ah, oh, I'm an idiot. You went right for it. Yeah. You can't you can leave and go yeah, back. You just... Okay, yeah, this is... Uh, the game. <clears throat> so you have to find the key first, and then you find the door, and then you get to the next level. So you're already full life but if you get that heart in the middle you get an extra there get it there now you have more life okay that's key so yeah. i'm gonna go up and see what's up so each level has its own maze oh god see like it's like and that oh, takes two and then i'm dead <laughs> jesus christ okay maybe this is maybe this is a me game it but no this takes be. a lot to get used to the movement and the different types of enemies. So let me bring up the instructions first, because okay. we need to uh, we need to get that one going, because that will help us out a lot. Oh, it's a fucking slider! <laughs> Damn it, man. Okay. Instructions. Oh. Controls, joystick, button, breathe fire in the direction it's facing. Uh, left difficulty uh, B, the game will end after you complete level 7. Uh, left difficulty A, I doubt we'll get to level 7, but uh, we'll continue indefinitely, ending it only in game over. So okay. let's hope and try and complete the game. Interesting. Uh, right difficulty A, you'll start in a randomized maze. B is the same layout, which is why we're doing the mapping. Yeah, man, I think Because if you do randomize, you will... That's what we you can't do. do mapping. You just try and find the key. Oh, God. Just run away. Just You can exit the level. He doesn't give yeah. you... Yeah. Actually, he can, he can give you heart if you are already down a heart a level. So... So that's the door. Oh, nice. He went with my suggestion. Was that what? I think that was one of my suggestions. What was it? That one looked good. Because he had different... Whoa. Oh no, this Whoa. is an earlier one. I suggested something uh, before, but uh, I think I like that one. Because no, they had different doors. Ah, oh, I just hit like the edge. When it needs a key. Nightmare. And when it has, when you have the key. And that one's, I, I like that one. Where it's blinking, it's like that, it, it's totally alerts you that it needs the key. Game select, uh, make sure the right difficulties B, allows you a random seed when starting the maze. Okay. Move the joystick left and right to select the right, left or right seed. It can be set to value between 1 and 255. So you can not only have a set maze, but you can have 255 set mazes. There's the key, obviously. Now the door is in the same place, so it's all the way to the right, then down. I've only mapped out this one level in my mind. Because oh it seems simple. The key's in the top left, the door's in the bottom right. So you're already full of health and everything, so don't bother. Oh, it's still blinking. So that's like, so that's. I like, would get rid of the so key. So now that's just level a blank two. Door. This is level two, right? Yeah. 
So, need to find, oh, what the fuck was that? Those are deadly. Okay, you have to keep moving, keep moving. It blinks on where you are. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so you can't stop and think. That's, but it's also not hard. I'm just like, I don't see much point in like killing people. Uh, only um, when you're down, um, like life, a life. I mean, a my points are not good, but no, nah, that's not what we're going for. Uh, like the stacks, random level selection. Yes. Yeah, exactly. You can, there's a seat. There's a door. So there's a door. Top, left. Top, top, top left. left is the door. So level two. I'm gonna go to, I'm just going to like the top right. We'll see what that where that what that does for us. There we go, I got it. Top right. Top right? Okay. Okay. Level key. Oh, I was like, oh god damn it. I keep forgetting that you like slide so much. Yeah. Okay. Come on. And the door is top left. I think on level one, the key is Got it. left. Nice, level three. Okay, I'm just going to go, like, way to the left. We'll and see the door what that is does. bottom right. Correct. Okay. Holy shit, yeah, because it's getting to be more of a maze now. But you already have full, oh, right? Yeah. But it's good if you do go down one. Bottom left. Okay, so now all the way to the left, and then up. Okay. Just seeing what's up. Nice. Top left again. Yeah, okay, so I'm going to the right to see what this does. What the fuck is this, man? Uh, just don't touch the sides. It's just a lot of... Oh, oh. run, 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 oh. run, run, run. Oh, Jesus Christ. There you go. There, you need that. I actually need another one or else the game over. Jesus Christ. I feel like this is the level, though. You know what I mean? Because it's just... I yeah. went to the top. Oh, oh no, 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 no. There you go. Oh! oh, my God. I've never seen this guy before. Shit. He can shoot down, so... This is so... And your shots don't go as far as his. I don't think. Whoa! You just missed. Just okay, leave. So, like, just leave. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Okay, okay. Fuck yeah. Okay, now... You're on the right-hand side. Yeah. You're just gonna go... Oh, my God. This fucker. Oh, my God! It's a baddie. He's on... You're on level three. You gotta defeat him. Oh, you're doing pretty good. Oh, oh God damn it. Okay. <sighs> is that, like... Is that all of them done now? We're back to the very beginning? Yeah. But, okay. We know where the keys are and the doors are, so we can just go. So the key's in the top left on this one. Eight different enemies. New ones appear on later levels. Okay. So it's kind of... I'll get a heart. For sure. Was it top left? Top is... left is the key. So just go all the way to the left, all the way up. Fuck. Those guys are just wandering. Looks like you've gotten used to the slidey. Yeah, I mean, it's like... I, I would much rather dodge people than actually fight yeah. them in this game, in all honesty. Yeah, unless you're down on health, just dodge them. There's no point. You're just risking yeah. yourself. And now bottom I, right? I love games like these. They're so fun. Yeah, man. With, this is with like levels, and you have to find things, and you have to do a little out. bit of mapping. What is it, bottom right? Bottom right, yeah. Yeah, okay. In his last game, um, Dragon... Dragon... Dragon something. Dragon, <gasps> Dragon Racer. Got it. Okay. Dragon Racer is so much fun. It's two players. Dude, he says every level also has a treasure room. Oh, well, let's oh, God. map out the treasure room if we run across it. So which one was this again? Because we only... Uh, this one key is in the top right. Okay. But try and take a different path. Because we found the treasure room on the first level, which is just straight over to the left. Oh, what? So how did we get there? This bot. This just went right. This is on the right. This just went right and then up. Right. Um. And that's a good path. I just went all the way to the right and then up, and that got me both all of the so things. How would we even say that? Um. What? Okay. Where's the? Where is this Stay one? In a safe I don't remember room. This what is it safe is. Room. 
Uh, we're on level two? Yeah. This What's is top left. Top left is the, is the key. The ring. Okay. Shit, these guys suck. Come at me. Uh, go right then up. Okay. How big are each of these? Is it a 16? A uh, 4 top by left? 4? Yeah. This is, this is top left. Oh Fuck, my I god. These guys so much, man. You know what? I think it's a random. Fuck it. Yeah. There you go. I like these guys, honestly. Yeah. Okay, so the key is in the top left. Okay. Nice. You're full anyway. So go left on the first level. Just top left, right? Yep, top left. Whoa! 8 by 8, by eight potential grid. Okay, so they're not definitely 8 by 8 some of them are different sizes. Levels themselves only use a fraction of that space. Mm. I wish I could shoot up. It's a real disadvantage. Yeah, it adds. It's adds part to of the, the it's part of the adventure though. It for is sure. part of the gameplay. Do they come back? Oh, they do. Yeah, they do. As and a it's different new guy. people too. So, so now what we do top bow. And then there's a boss. So I got to add the boss too. What is it? It's like, oh yeah, I think I did this last time. The boss is so lower hard. bottom right, I think. Yeah. But there is a treasure room Whoa. somewhere. Which, which is like helpful, something but to be... Which isn't bad. Those guys are good too because they do a beeline. Oh, oh my god. Oh, <laughs> well, it's not. It's like, it's hard though because as much as I'd love to just nail it. <laughs> it is hard, especially when those rooms are really full. Well, yeah, that stuff. one's the hardest because I was like... There's no room to maneuver. Okay, this is the boss. Whoa. Oh, oh Jesus my Christ. God. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> no. It's like a big dragon head. It's, that's a hard level, man. Okay. Feel confident? You can do another one? Oh, so, so. Should I do it? I should. Do you want to try? Yeah. Yeah. I've got some things in here. Okay, I can give you some. This is interesting because you don't discover everything. on. You don't have to discover yeah. everything. On each level. So yeah, top oh, top left. To this. No, the treasure room is two to the left, so I think I have that mapped down already. Yeah. This, this, yeah the first treasure room is like impossible to miss, basically. Yeah. <laughs> it's on your way. <laughs> well, it's almost cool because we don't have to map out everything. We just need to know like where our kind of objective is, which is really nice. Yeah. But definitely a, to discover every treasure room would be super helpful in yeah. the la later levels because you need that you need life. It. And the, that's the only way you can get extra lives above your, your yeah. thing, right? Otherwise Absolutely. you're yeah. screwed. You are screwed. So it would be good to find the treasure room um, on each of the yeah. levels. Yeah, I would just get rid of that flashing key. You have the key, therefore it's just a door. Okay, where is this one? So this is chop right but then the go go completely right first yes okay for the for the for the treasure, treasure. room so you just go all the way right and then you and then go up. up it's a little bit of a harder journey but you'll get there and the next one's the treasure room if i remember correctly i could be wrong yay yay well memory is good there we go now i'm green and so now it's uh top left is the door oh, okay you come this way come over here come this way there we go <laughs> honestly the hardest part of, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Um, and then it's left, top left for the door. So you just keep going left and you're good. So we just don't know the treasure room. I think we should look around on the next level for the treasure room. Yeah, because it's like having extra stuff is not a bad thing at all. Yeah. Keep going up, yeah. Not left, yeah. Ah! Well, you gotta... It's so hard, eh? What's it gonna be? Ah, it's fine. Yay! Okay. So top left is the key. So we'll get that first. Oh, but you could go down if you wanted oh, to do yeah. some exploring. Oh yeah, we should. We might honestly. as well explore while we're going. Because I never, I never really did that. Jesus. Yeah, this is like where the... You might even just want to spawn someone different. Yeah, okay. It's we're good. too bad. Ah! Yeah, just keep going down. We'll just explore. Ah, uh, there we go. So what is this? It's like down, like like bottom. Like I'd say like I'd say like 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 bottom middle. Yeah, we'll do that. 
bottom middle, yeah. Because that's really what it is. Yay! And it, it puts you up to full, too. Whoa, great. Nice. Oh, yeah, because it's like power-ups. That's fucking essential. Nice. Oh, There's that's no question really good. That that's, we have to do that on every level. Yeah. Mm. Oh, he says you might want to get at least one lamp before facing the mid-boss. Oh, what is the lamp? Since it halves the number of shots you need to fight oh, him. Oh, so yeah. I guess So I guess instead of... So you have an upgrade. So, okay, so where are all the... It's a balance, then. What are all the upgrades stand for? Uh, the lamp is powerful shot. The life. The life the, is life, and the other things just. And points. the diamonds points, yeah. Ah, it's well, actually a good one. If I didn't do that, it is a good one for this kind of level. Whoa. Yeah, so we should probably do two. <gasps> what? What? Oh no! This. What happened? Is that a bug or is that no, like real? No, it's part of it. God, I'm man. taking too long. That's the problem. Whoa. This is gonna be deadly, though. I don't know how to do this. Is that a heart? No, nothing. Well, you Whoa. just fire. No. Yeah, like how? It was easy too. Easy guy. I'm taking too long. Okay. Now you got the key, so Am we're I back. Am I still good? No, it's oh, Jesus I'm so Christ! Dead. How do you even do this? I'm you gonna go, go around, I think. <gasps> Whoa! Is that like another dragon? Look oh, at look no, at this I'm motherfucker! What is this thing? It's a dragon, and, and you can go through walls. Nice. And it's That's, like at least you can't fire. Well, good, good that we like know this stuff. Holy shit! Oh my god, I'm dead. But your health is. And I'm right. He's on right on me. Ha! Huh. <laughs> dark... Yeah, so they don't camp for points. It's a good choice, man. Very good choice. Okay. Okay, let's do it. And, and then we'll we get know... and we'll get the lamp this time. That'll yeah. help. It's a good suggestion, dude. It's not an easy game. <laughs> it is not. An Especially if you get that cat right away. Yeah, dude. Like, Thanks. damn it. And also, you know, also, honestly, the dragon is tough because, like, he shoots in a very specific place, but it's not exactly in the middle of your thing. Like, I, you know what I mean? Like, it's more intuitive yeah. to think it would come out of his... Jesus. That's okay. I'll get the heart. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't come from him. Yeah, so it's, like, a very interesting... Nope. Oh, so it's, like, a whale? Too? It's a lamp. A lamp. Oh, like an oil lamp. Yeah, so top... Yeah, top left... And then Which sit. most people have never seen an oil lamp except in video games. It's true. <laughs> I thought it was a genie's lamp almost. Well, that's that's what it is too. That's what genie lamps are usually. Oh, cool. Or they're the tall ones, like, like the tall ones with the spout. No camping. Yeah, bottom right. That darkness thing. And then it just spawned dragons. I Jesus. do need a heart though. You do. Maybe I'll get one here. Ugh, that is a smart programming. You see what he's doing? Um, he made the guy below your shot. Oh, uh, well. I'll get one when I can, I guess. Oh, give me a heart! But be careful, because you might summon that darkness, oh, right? It's deadly. Okay, which one is, where uh, is this? Uh, key, because I go to the right. Right, then up. Right, then up, yeah, that's the, that's the gig. Oh, there we go. Hey, Yeah, and I Yeah, and I'd get, like... Get the health and then yeah the, because then, I'm down one yeah and then the lamp for the next one yeah looks like a whale <laughs> but it's not it's definitely not it seems to be like actually like decent like it seems like you're getting more like like almost two hits out of well because health. I was down one that's yeah, why which is really good this is all the way to the left uh, uh, top. yeah top left so however you however you want to get there. Oh god. Yeah, this one's a it's good but bad. I'd say it's like a, yeah, one of the easier ones. Okay, so bottom middle is where you got to you got to just blast to. Yeah, good. This is a shooter by the way. Yeah. So you almost like might want to respawn him. Uh in all yeah, honesty. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Perfect. Good. Yes, cuz cuz time is not on our side either. Yeah. So I want a lamp for this one even yeah. though down one. Oh, because does that give you extra power? Yeah, I don't know how it works. I forget how it works now. Okay, top left? Yeah, uh, yes, top left. And then you got to go through that shit stuff, but you'll get there. Oh, look at that. Whoa. My, my firepower is 
Bigger. Way better. Bigger. Okay, actually, this is good for like even just getting through these levels, man. It looks bigger too. Oh, got a heart. Nice. It is. It's a little bit taller, which is. Oh, you have a limited supply of it, though. Oh, do I? Power up shots. So you might want to like honestly just get Save to that it. boss. Yeah. Save it for the but boss. But God knows how many like shots this boss is gonna take. I know. Yes. Oh my God! I hate when I accidentally press down. So I find this to be hard, but like once you get it, it's done. You know. Because sometimes they'll spawn like right at the doorway, and it's like your Sisyphus just pushing boulders up hills and being rolled back down. Yep. Okay, good luck to me. You got this, dude. Yes. Yes, just what I needed. No, what? already? Oh my god, and now we gotta fucking fight this boss with this? Whoa. And you got... Whoa. Oh Holy my god, no. shit. Mm, and I was full. Power up gets wider each lamp. I don't know. What should I do? Maybe just one life power up? And then two lamps? No, man, I'd do, I'd do the same thing. Yeah. I think you just needed a better go at it. Because if you tr if you circled him a bit, you know what I mean? If you trained him around a little, yeah. I think you were close. Um, you just I need another so. go at it. Yeah, and so. the health is the only option, I think. Yeah, two, two health and... And we found the power up, the treasure? Yeah, yeah, we've got the level. treasures on all okay, the levels. So we can't, so we can't really anymore. do any more than that. How many levels are there in this game? It said seven. Okay, so like, so we're in, uh, you know. A, a level three better, boss. Better and, than nothing. Yeah. I mean, it's hard enough. We should for sure try to beat this boss. Oh, yeah. At least beat the boss today. Yeah. Okay, what's this one? Over um, and then up. Uh, yeah, just right. Go all the way to the right, and then like go up, and then go all the way to the left. It's actually an easy one. It's like a circle, pretty much. No. Yeah. Health, I'd say. Yeah. I because it's like you it's need so that health. You need. You do it. to get to the. To get to the 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 level that you need to, it's more useful than the shots at this oh, point. Oh, um, Splendid Nuts saying he's taken off, and thanks for showing Chaotic Grill, man. Yeah, you know, thank thanks you for so making much. it, man. I appreciate that yeah. a lot. It's a cool game. And it's getting so close. Um, that level six is a motherfucker, but we'll beat it someday. <laughs> yeah, I was really close. I yeah, think with yeah, a little bit more. Totally. Okay, I gotta so move bottom fast. middle. Yeah, so just go like, for just it, and then if you don't run. like them, just respawn them. Like, don't even think about it. Because I don't have time. Genie. Bam. Yeah. And now you're going to go top left. Um, and just... Need the heart. Yeah, it's, it's all good. But you can... You, what you should do is just try to get to, like, the, the level. Because you can always, like, train. You can always get some more stuff, right? Yeah. If you're, like... Because then... Because it, it doesn't seem to, like, black it right before the boss. So you might want to farm the screen right before the boss. You know what I mean? Mm. So I would just aim on getting to that place as fast as possible. Don't worry about your health. And then we can always try to get some more health. Um, cause, cause the, cause navigating this maze through the blackness, impossible. But it's if you had to so just kill hard. one room that was fairly open, um, see, so I would just respawn right now. Yeah. Just do it. And then push. Yeah. Perfect. This is what we want. But we do need the, we do need that health. Okay. The bottom right. Damn it. That gets you. Yeah. This when is you a you run tough into one. a room and those things are there. It's like boom. It's okay. We will. We'll get. I we'll, need we'll a farm health. it, but don't farm it until we until we're like one away. Right away. Yeah. So um, I don't. Almost there. Yeah. This is the last one. There we go. So you want to farm this screen? Not with that guy. Yeah. Re redo it. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice. And we just need some health. We just need some health. That's all we need. Come on. Yay. Okay, one. that's one. Keep going though, and it. Oh no. Oh, it's just a dude. Oh, does it not get health? Good. Oh, sure. I'll take that. <laughs> not gonna refuse it. Yeah, because... Oh, it's the same guy each time. Is it? I don't know, but... I'm gonna keep taking it. We got this. Another lamp. Nice. Oh, because I have to kill him. Oh, God. Oh, this is where maybe our tactic could be better. Oh, is this... Is he invincible? Yeah, I think he's invincible. Is he invincible? 
is he like uh, death in Ga uh, Gauntlet? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. I yeah, you can't wait too long. You nah, just gotta man, go for you, it after a bit. Yeah, it's it's fucked, man. You gotta just get through the 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 health. You you know. You just can't make a mistake, which is. That's not what anyone wants to hear. <laughs> you just can't make a Just don't make any mistakes, and just you'll be you'll be awesome. Yeah, you know, in tennis, just knock the ball so it's like right in the corner, like the back corner, and just yep. do that every time, yep. and then you'll win. And don't miss either. You know, just like <laughs> in basketball, just take half court shots and get them in every time. <laughs> it's easy. Three, get those three points. Concentrate on the three <laughs> just, point just, shots. Just nail the three pointers every time, and you, you you're the best. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I never thought of that. Oh, what a genius. It's More just... like the pterodactyl and Joust. And then right. Invincible. Yeah, so right. very hard. And I shot him like three, four times. It's a game called Prince of Persia. It's a sec there's a second one. Yeah. There's this thing called the Dahaka, which just follows you. So you have levels where you just run from this demon. I'll come down. And one of the cool things about that game is like he's 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 defeated with water. So oh. you have to like to defend yourself, you have to just like like turn like on like a, a waterfall or something oh. and then it'll like fill the ground. Yeah. And then in the and but what you can do is there's a bonus obvious. there's like a bonus level which you have to like perfectly play the game and you can get like a water sword and then kill it. Oh, okay. Uh, it's a cool game, man. I like it's one of my favorite games. Um is uh Damn it, die. Get out of here. That was terrible. But I'm getting a lamp this time. I know, time. this is the challenge of this, this game. Give me a heart. Ugh. And, you, and you don't have time to farm either. Ugh, I don't. Oops. Well, maybe that's for the best, man. Maybe In it all is. honesty. Maybe, because maybe you can farm up the lamp from one of these fuckers. Because you, know, oh. you, you, you know? You can't. You can't. If you, you don't If you don't have it, you can't farm it. Oh. I don't think you just get a lamp. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. But no, your your creature reminds me of the Dahaka. That's what it is. It's a Dahaka. I just need to get through him. Oh, he's a moving cat face. Oh, no. This is not going well. No, man. It's tough because it's almost like you might even just want to like reach start at this point because it's like you know you don't have you don't <laughs> have health or a lamp so <laughs> <laughs> there's no advantage. No, there plus isn't. there's gonna be this darkness soon. In about two seconds. Yeah. So. Why does it always spawn there? Because it's where you don't want. You said you can try tanking it. You need to just aggressively shoot it. I think we need to... I think basically we got to get there with a lamp and full life. Yep. That's all we need. Yep. Um, I mean, maybe, like, we can do it with, like, one, like, life lost, but I... Yeah. I, but I don't... I think you could. The tre treasure room is key for this game. It is. That's a good game, though, man. That's a cool game. Yeah, any game where you have to figure out the balance... It's challenging. ...and what to bring into the boss levels with you is is good um yeah the the farming <laughs> it doesn't let you farm no man and i'll tell you guys for the for the folks at home who maybe haven't played this the movement is actually a fairly challenging because it's, it's like you're on ice it. you're sort of always sliding yeah. so like you don't get that effect watching it no. but it's definitely a real part of it and it's tricky because you know when you get to levels like this where you have to navigate like a maze it's like there's no option but to just try to like yeah more of these guys please yeah i i'd say a heart oh yeah right yeah and then the next one is going to be lamp that's right on level and yeah just to the left you're fine Remember that alien game we played once? That was a crazy game. That was really hard. The 3D one? Yeah. Uh, that was a really interesting game. First person perspective is is very hard for me. Like single room yeah. at a time first person perspective really does me in. Yeah, that was it took me a while to wrap my brain around. Just respawn that fucker, yeah. It's not all fine. it's not all done yet. Come up here. What are you doing? That's the hard part about not being able to shoot down, in all honesty. 
Yeah, I do. I do land. Come okay. On. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, not shooting down. But I can see. Oh, get out of here. It, this one's just such a big roundabout way to get everything that. It's not a terrible thing because you could use that heart. But it just so. takes so long. Did I get a heart from him? Oh, God. Whoa, okay, good work, good work. Yeah, just that, go, keep going. Oh, yeah, up here, there. That's exactly. Keep go going. there, yep. What do we got here? Good. Yeah. Random dude. Okay. Now, honestly, time is not on your side, so Unfortunately, like. Unfortunately, this is a slow trudge through these things. Ooh, see, this is the hard part. Oh my god. And then there's no recovery, man. That's Unless the I shoot something and get one heart. Yeah. Which is like... Dude. There's a chance. Yeah, I guess it's gonna be dark. Oh, oh, and then we're dead. Fuck, man. <laughs> okay, we gotta beat this. We gotta beat god, this. We gotta, we gotta get this. What is this, like 130? That's alright. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're fine. We're fine. Whoa. And it, they don't appear right away, which, you know, is smart because you don't want it appearing right on top of you. This is a like a proper, like, classic game where you kind of, you only have eight levels and you're like, ugh, eight levels, that's no not problem. much. Seven. You know, or seven, sorry. And then in reality, like, it's no. like, okay, so you're going to replay the first three levels for an hour and a half. <laughs> and then, like. Then a whole new hell unleashes after that. And, and, and you're just going to keep working it and, like, you're going to be an Olympic athlete to even get to level six. But that's that's the cool thing, right? That's again, I've said it on the show a million times. But that's my big critique of modern games is that they just they have so much content that is easy that you yeah. just it, you, that's something I just miss about classics. You right? feel like you're just get, getting through the game. Yeah, you're kind. They're hangout. You're sort of wandering about. That was risky, but play some '80s montage music. Absolutely right. Yeah, that's right. Freedom! <laughs> Working hard every day. The the best Gotta one. Gotta get to the top. The best shit ever is the is the Rocky Four montage of him driving his car. That's so good, and it's like he's he's like living like the Rocky years. It's like Rocky Four is the craziest one. I, you know, I almost love Rocky Four the best because it's like. It's insanity that this movie was made. Like Dolph Lundgren and like, oh, yeah. you know, and he's like, he's like punching steel his head. Like it's so crazy. Out of control. And he goes to Russia and just lifts like rocks. It's <laughs> so good. That's my favorite montage of all time probably. 80s montage. Really? Right there? Oh God. But I'm full right now. Which is good. I'm not complaining. Well, the I'm thing that you got to get lamp once, right? Because yeah. the dope thing about that is then you can spawn the bonus, more of them, yeah. and then you can pretty much... It seems like you can pretty much just have the lamp the whole time. Yeah. Once yeah, you get lamps, it once. It does, goes down pretty slow, there, this but one, you get enough of them that fills up... Yeah, you're going to respawn it. Now, take your time. You're doing well, man. you got you got the time is on your side. Yeah. This guy's fairly easy. Just yeah. one more screen like this, I think, and then you're oh, good. Oh, good. He and, gave me a good one. <sighs> Damn it! The, as slippery ice. Yeah, and especially you. when you're like, you're, you've got no you're room, scared, man. See, so there you go. No okay. option. Do like a little bit of farming, but not much. Yeah, because you're you're wise. Oh, perfect to... for farming. Okay. Yeah, just let him like come to. That's okay. not what I wanted, but what do I got? Oh, good. Because it goes dark first as a warning. Yes. And then that fucking invincible guy comes. Oh, yeah, get out of here. Oh, does just, it lock just go, the door? Just go for it. I will just go for it now. Because, cause like, there's, there just reaches a point, too, where it's like, you just gotta fight him. You can't go horizontally fast enough. Oh, my God. What a level, man. You can't turn around and get past him fast enough. He just hits you. Yeah. And then you got those rocks firing. Oh, I know, it's tough. What time are we at? We're like uh, 143. You, you can, can circle him. Not easily. No, it's tricky. And and there's whoa. a pattern. Oh, is it like 
comp like that continuous circle, like do not stop. Okay, we'll do one more. Yeah, but then we have to. We got a mosey. Then we gotta call it because, you know, yeah. I'm I'm in like you know. Yeah. Oh yeah. We've done twelve you know, twelve hour marathon. Like we can <laughs> do, we can we can do this, but it's we also regularly do three hour shows. But you know, we're hungry. Yeah, at a Dying. certain point. Do, do which days tend tend to be the longest? Oh. Do you find that like, do you find that like um? It depends because. I guess the game, right? The ones like this, where I'm going back to a game. And I want to defeat it. Is a long game, is a long day, and those are Fridays now always, because I do um, the Activision. Patch oh, challenges, that's right. right, and those are just that's a whole other challenge. Yeah, it is. Sometimes I, uh, sometimes they're easy and I get it done. Yeah. Um, and sometimes they're like, oh my god, I don't think I can't I can't beat this today, but I'll get really good today. Yeah. It's a, they, they'll, I mean, you're going for, like, you know, things that people can yeah. spend their whole lives not getting. Like, well, like seriously. true, true. You know, like, it, it's it's something that takes time and, and patience. Does. Like, some of them are really easy, maybe because I'm better at those types of games, and some of them are just harder. Maybe they put the, the score up too high. At least I know everything now. Well, yeah, this is it. it I compare it to Castlevania, where Castlevania is like that game with those like Medusa heads. You know, it's like you oh, just God. have to get good at this game. Like, there's this no. This is the lamp one. Right? Yeah, lamp one. You want to do. I like the different colors for different levels too. And so his advice was really was do not stop. Is the is is the oh is yeah the, for sure like is don't... the credo of this game, and he's totally right. It's like you just like, keep you going. know the maze, just keep keep moving constantly, and. Really? That oh. was that's terrible. That's terrible. That's so unfair. And then we're fucked, basically. Okay, let's we we, we we got this. We got this. One more time. One more, one more time. time. One more time. I well, you're you you chill. Look, well, you because you could have gotten the you get full uh, heart. Ah, true. But that's okay. That's okay. That's true. You're really actually totally fine. It's not until you know there. It's the third there level. There is the honest. Ugh, yeah, that's it's when the it's third bad. level. You can't lose anything on the third level. And I think your method is is good. Like, there's only the path, yeah. the pathway. Because I was gonna say it's maybe we do the one. lamp last, but that doesn't help because. Well, I wonder though because um I think you struggle most with those top ones, those top I was screens. Thinking about avoiding those. Let's see Going about below them. Yeah, let's try that out instead because we've I'm been sort of lives. we've been doing the same thing. Yeah. You know, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing, <laughs> believing it'll have a different result. Exactly. You know? And it's not having a different result. No, it's like... I mean, I'm still getting to the boss and just dying. Yeah. Oh, he says, why start over when you can retry a level? Is that possible? What? I mean, I guess we can, but at the end of the day, too, though, it's like... Yeah, I'm fine. We can retry, but it's also like this is totally a game that. Oh, I see. Start on level three, but you're not gonna have all these bonuses. I don't think so, or the bonuses you're that you start think with you zero. want. Zero. Yeah, I think so, but maybe not. Let's. We, he said mainly for random levels. Yeah, because if you're if you're starting with nothing, that's gonna be devastating. Trying to. Okay, good. Yeah, these ones aren't too bad. Lamp it up, yeah. Lamp it up. Good stuff. Yeah, I am... Um, Seriously, I just... died trying to get the lamps probably going to disappear. There we go. God damn it. That's not what I wanted. If I die, I want a heart. Oh. Come on. Yay. Yay. Give Take me a heart, that. though. Well, well, you know. Yeah. We'll see. It's about huh? the right amount of you get this uh, or not when they drop something. It's not too often, but no thanks. No. Nope. Rip. <laughs> that guy's like, no, 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 no. Yeah, ignore. It's taking too long, though. So, okay, so now go down and let's, let's, like, let's try that out this time. Fuck. At least it's There's different no path. approach. Ugh, that's much worse. Or is it? We'll see. We'll see. No, oh, yeah, no, no it's path. just it's completely retracing. Oh. That's what we yeah, there's no I option. gotta commit. 
Yeah, we have. And it to. probably is there no path to Dude, it. Dude, I bet you you're right. It's you. It's oh. a one way path. Oh, I'm so dead. Damn it. I don't have any hearts either. We got nothing. We got a heart. It's gonna be dark. Yeah, fuck. We're done. Rip. <laughs> oh God. Can't deal with these guys in the dark. I gotta just power, 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 power. That's hilarious. And now I gotta do those in the dark. And this invincible uh, Dahaka will appear very soon. Very soon. Oh my god, you're doing very well considering the situation you're stuck yeah, in. Just and you're losing all your lamp. Yeah, because I have to keep lighting up the screen. That's fucked. <laughs> I can't kill that guy, so I can't get anything back. I have no well, lives left, so I'm just going to look at the look at the enemy and die. Well, you can go... There, hi guy. Let's see this strategy. At least I'll be able to practice. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's how it's done, man. Just those circles. One more? Yeah. One Fuck more. yeah, let's do it. Yeah, the game I play, the one that's like more long, like the big one that I that I talk about on the show. Yep. I finished the league. Like I got had a goal and it's oh, like, all my goals totally done. Oh, so nice. it's nice I'm done with it for like a while but the, the funniest thing about that and those programmers are so good it's Grinding Gear Games they're from um, Australia oh really they're very good developers and they're so smart that like I literally am done with the league and the next league is starting in 10 days wow like they know they've kind of they scienced the out. exact amount of time that like um, right. gamers would want to play so Our camera's giving up by the way. oh no Sorry. okay let me fix it yeah For the last time. <laughs> it's amazing. It's an amazing thing that like they have figured out like exactly the rhythm of their player base. So oh the yeah, they don't want to have any gaps. No, and it's funny because their their formula is to not even they don't even have a drastically different game. They just do some additions, and everyone's just such a fan of it that like. Zoom it. Again, this is one of these games where you know what to do. You just need to do it. Yep. Oh, did you see it? It looked like it almost went dark right before you went in it. Oh my god, double Jesus. shot. What oh. is happening? It's like... It feels like, a, you know, one of those, like, games where, like, if one thing goes wrong, everything falls apart. <sighs> yes. I'm I might gonna, go heart, I'm honestly. Go heart, yeah. So that you can just, like, have a shot at this. Yeah, if I went lamp, I'd have no shot. Not a chance. I mean, he's right, the lamp makes sense, but it's... It does, but... But in, in you, got, you gotta play the board, man. You gotta look yeah. at what the board is telling you. Plus, this gives me unlimited shots without worrying about running out. Not that that makes any sense, but... No, but it's good. At it's this, like... in this point. What are you? Yeah, I don't like you very much. That's a double hit to get that guy. Uh, oh, no. Not always. I like that the dragon changes color. Yeah, Depending on the health. upgrade. Yeah, so like you're a blue dragon now, which is like... <sighs> Slippery. It's, I need that's, a health. It's ah. not. It's not easy, man. It is not. That's, especially that's, in these tight levels. Yeah. So you can farm a bit in our level. Yeah. For sure. It's worth doing it just in case. It is. Cause, uh, cause then you can just pop out right when there's like the. Right when there's the. the Come on, random dude. Yes. yes. Go okay, for now it. It's time. Deadly at the top because. Ah. Oh. Yeah, it seems to be like what counterclockwise is better. It does. I don't think it matters too much. But you've got to turn around and. Oh, new color, new color. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. It's it's so hard. Whoa, dude. I think we gotta call it, man. Yeah, we Honestly. do. Honestly. We made a lot of progress. It's almost two. Oh, damn. Oh my god. Great game. Oh my god, man. That is really, really good Switch over to this. Oh. There we go. 
And didn't we didn't need to do as much mapping as possible. That no, did, it's... Dude, this fucking deserves the Satan symbol. For sure, <laughs> the Satan skull <laughs> gas mask like, ma like, like symbol. This is a oh, tough one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, excellent, excellent game. Rem Tooley says, thanks for playing. Thank hey, you man, for making my, it. Our pleasure. I actually, as much as a gamer, I hate it. I'm so in awe of the design of the um, uh, screen going black and the dragon appearing. Yeah, great it's such a It's a, such an amazing design choice. I hate it so much, <laughs> but it's so good because it makes the game so much more challenging. That's the biggest issue with these games yeah. is the farming aspect. Do you think it's too hard? I think it's possibly too hard. It might, it might be on the edge of too hard. The, the amount of time you get, maybe you can extend it just a little bit before yeah. it goes black. I mean, um, I, I might also suggest that maybe a couple less shots for that boss, potentially. Uh, I, I don't think so. That's I think hard. when you get the power-up, like, I was almost getting him and you with had, no power-up. Yeah, you, see, you could probably do it. But uh, you know what? In all honesty, if you only got seven levels, like, maybe, yeah. this, maybe this is the perfect difficulty because, you know, uh, then, then you really have, like, a game that you have to, like, seriously oh, get great it. at. See, what, does this give me... Oh. Retry maze. See, it doesn't give me full power. So, yeah. How you, can you earn your full? I think power this is back? the first. This is the first level. Oh, so well, that's not the same maze. Is it? The yeah, you said I. I did want to make a game you can't beat in an afternoon. Well, that's what you've definitely done, man. And yeah, it's this is the same thing. And it's classic. Like it's done in. I mean, that's not terrible to get you the. You get a lot of shots. It's not terrible to get the this one first, honestly. Uh, um, yeah, because it maintains because, itself pretty well. Well, actually, you know what? The benefit of getting this one first, James, is that uh, you can then get full health when you hit that that thing on the third level, right? Oh, so that, that is gives true. you that gives you some leeway, and because you can, you're surviving pretty well all of them except for the last one. Oh, they're not seeing this. Yeah, let's do one more. Fuck, we gotta do it. We gotta do it. I think we so we found a new approach. <laughs> That might be the way, man. It might be. It might, might be. Because if you run out, you just get another lamp again. Yeah, from killing these guys. And then you have the possibility of a lamp or a health. Exactly. Like hit. I don't know if it's like... Gives you even And honestly, amount. probably getting the lamp first might be the best. We often get the lamp first. Now you tell Since us. you one-shot all enemies in the first three levels, dude, uh, that makes so much sense. We've been, we've been totally doing this wrong. Because, yeah, you need that full health at that see? third point. Because I've been getting killed sometimes. On yeah. That. Oh, God. It's so true. And now we got the health. And now we're pretty even, right? And that shot lasts quite a while. They get more later. Oh, so like enemies have one to two health, but they get more later. Oh, that makes so sense. It does, it's not going to last past level three. But it's still like pretty decent. Yeah, this yeah. guy's not too bad. Okay. So we're already to level three. You do, do go pretty fast if you memorize the, uh, memorize the mazes. But you can't win without memorizing the mazes. For sure. You don't have time. Yeah. I mean, it didn't give you an insane. Whoa. It didn't give you an insane advantage, but it does give a little bit of a cushion. The memorizing, or no, do you the, mean this pattern. The the yeah. the getting the lamp first. Although I think it's great. I think that it helps you mess with these enemies, which is a big deal. Yeah, especially when it goes to this mazy part here. Yeah. After this. Okay. Because you don't have time to shoot them twice here. No, you don't. Yeah, just fuck to. it. Just don't even. Yeah, I'm full these right guys. now. Yeah, and keep, it was easy, and I didn't have keep to. Keep going. Think you've also about it. you've also done it. Now like I don't have to farm. ten times. That's true. <laughs> that is very true. Whoa! Oh my whoa. god! Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Holy shit! Blue. Whoa! Whoa! Damn it! Yes! Did I die or win? I think I got him. Yes. Oh my god, but you got no health now. <laughs> no health whatsoever. That's hilarious. Oh my god, but dude, that's that was our goal. So that helped that little... There we go. Oh god, okay, now we know... I don't know where anything We don't know is. where we're going, but it seems to Ooh, be... No, 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 no. It seems to be in like the top 
of things. You top know what left, I mean? Like it's a top right. left. It seemed yeah. So it's like wise for us to push to the corners of these mazes. Yeah, I've never found any any of the keys or doors in and, the oh, center. This is a much bigger maze now. Yeah, so, it's new well, guy. Whoa, what ghost. But our yeah. little lamp fucks him up. Okay, that's our thing. Uh, top one over to the right. Can you? Uh, top, top second from left. Top second from left. Is the door. Oh my god, I hate that guy. He's just too hard. Yeah. Oh, the ghosts go through the maze. That makes sense. <sighs> At least we have something. Well, no, we got that's we the, got our goal. No, that's the door. Oh shit, man. I'm sorry. Nice. You don't have white out. <laughs> <laughs> just take that that whole line and put four down. Yeah, that's a take good idea. Because there's just no room there. Well, we did accomplish it. We went back. And did it. Obviously, mm -hmm. amazing game. Amazing, amazing. So, let's go through the games. Oh, yeah. Daredevil, awesome graphics. Whoa, amazing so good, Amazing sound. Man. Challenge. It's the right level of challenge. This is a um, good run of games, man. Oh, Cha my God, yeah. Chaotic Grill is a really fun one. Yeah, we really, almost really beat hard. It. That last, that close. I, honestly, that last level is, like, Killer. so much harder than everything else. Yeah, I think they should open up um, a level design challenge. For chaotic grill, oh, for you sure. Could, I would, you could do so many levels, so it, many different types of levels, and then you could ramp up to that one because that's for yeah, sure a really good final one. Yeah, but you could do a couple last. more in between that, which would be cool. So you didn't have much trouble with any of the other. No, you, you actually cleared the board. Like yeah, without Your first dying. Time ever playing that game. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, definitely that one goes last. Um, but it needs some. It, need, it needs some more harder ones before that one. Yeah. Sokobu. Sokobu perfect it's oh yeah like how can you improve on that game he's got all the elements for that type of puzzle game and he's he's got enough room for tons of levels he'll keep oh, people crazy. busy for years yeah like literally years so if you love that type of puzzle game go for it that is an awesome game dragon's descent great and i think i think we can take i can take back that time allotment before it gets dark now that we figured out that's that balance strategy yeah. i made it there in in plenty of time yeah it was a lot it was such a good choice because then it made you clear the board so much faster and just got yeah. you there also practice makes perfect yeah just that firepower really helped and right it's and you know i do commend you for trying to make a game you can't play in the afternoon that it requires <laughs> some refinement you know yeah. I, as i say one i always i keep saying it but like it's like that castlevania on nes right it's like no one can beat that game in one go no. for the first time yeah because you need to learn all the things and you're like oh and then you like are doing so well with your holy water and then you like accidentally get like a knife and you're like damn it <laughs> and uh same with this shit you accidentally get like a health and you need a thing you're like ah like, oh, oh. i need lamp um but i think the variety of enemies is wonderful the game balance is so good it's so tight on that game um it's really really well done reventuli and his other game we have to play it again it's a uh, when we do another marathon, I think we did play yeah. it. Did we play the two-player dragon chasing game around? I don't think we did. I don't think so. Yeah, I got to include we got that a dragon on the next, theme, which is awesome. On the next marathon, he's he made that game as well. Oh, that's uh, awesome. Dragon, dragon chase. And um, he just said it too. He's like, you know, he's gotten glass cannon all lamps sometimes. Oh, that's a hilarious glass strategy. Glass cannon is that a term? Yeah, that you've heard it's RPG is really common. Yeah. Um, it, often uh, wizards are referred to as glass cannons because yes. they they can deal a lot of damage, but they're very weak. Yeah. Um, so it's, it's or tanks is like the opposite yeah with all can, defense but you can't really deliver much damage yeah <laughs> you totally just, you just absorb it's and it's kind of it is kind of like that's sort of the classic like thing for the three party thing you get like a wizard that's a glass cannon you get a yeah. warrior that's a tank and then you get a rogue to like steal and unlock and who's fast and nimble. stealth yeah and so then they can go off and do all that stuff but for this game you need that balance you need to f tread the line yeah between power and defense. And then if you become an expert, you can yeah. totally do it. Hi, Atari's joined us for the end of the yeah, show. Yeah, buddy. We got ourselves a little kitten. Yeah. So thank you, everybody, okay. Um, okay, for so joining sweet. us. Um, next episode is on the Friday, and I think it's with Tanya. Another great show. It was a good show. Yeah, it was a good show, man. And it all hinges on the games. Oh, my God. You definitely. get good, good games, you get a good show. And variety and a lot too. Of good games. And variety too. You can't play four puzzle games. You can't play four shooter games. It's nice you too. have to mix it up, and I usually try and do that. 
Um, so we're going to be playing on Friday Egg Venture 2600. <gasps> yep. Uh, it is not... It is the it's, other version. The other version is the, up, the updated? It's not updated, but it's, it's, it is an updated one. Yeah. That, that I didn't have that we didn't play. And it's totally different. With and it's bird a lot person. Easier. It is a bird person. He looks totally different. But bird you can actually person. play it properly and not die instantly. Uh, we're going to be playing Go Fish, which is a fun little fun little game. Where you eat, you eat fish that are smaller than you and you get bigger and you eat bigger fish. and Yeah, mm. fun little game. And we're going to try for Sky Jinx patch. Oh, uh, shit. So I don't know if I'll add another game in there. Uh, Egg Venture is going to take some time. Go Fish is a simple game. It's just a fun, relaxing game. Uh, and Sky Jinx is going to be yeah. hell on earth, like all Activision patch <laughs> patches. Um, Thrust 26, good one. No weak ones by far this time. Yeah, it was strong. Yeah, it's a good mix, man. Strong. Very good mix. Yeah. Um, I suppose a good show, good games. Oh, thanks, guys. Awesome mix of games. Yeah, it's awesome. The Trey Guy, thanks for the stream. Revan Tooley, Our great pleasure, show. Man. You guys take care. Repentless VG was with us as well. Uh, Splendid Nuts. So many people. Gretem's popped around. Yeah, Gretem's said something for a second. And she did. Andrew Davies because I was being here. controversial with my generalizations. That's right. Militant Buddhist 1, Kev73. Arena Foot was here on his break. He that was awesome. Yeah. Oh, What's oh. this guy? Discos? Dios Kilos? Dios Kilos. Dude, we should have 80. emphasized. I hadn't heard it about you before. Yeah. And Any like, chance talking. of making this game under a bank switching scheme that works with Harmony? No. No, no. <laughs> oh, so there was an answer and it was from the developer. Yeah. And, okay, good. We didn't... Listen to me. Listen to Andrew or me. Console, you need to have the right switch. <laughs> yeah, that was when we were trying to figure out. That's yeah, Andrew great. David really likes that bank switching scheme, uh, 3E, um, because I believe the uh, also the boulder dash doesn't work. I think it does. Anyway, he likes it for some reason. Um, who else Muddy was Funster. Muddy Funster as well. Yeah, it was great having all four developers. That's true. It's always so much more fun, man. It we is. get to you do get it. Feedback, and... They get to hear... What we are seeing on the screen right away, if we're having trouble or we give suggestions, and they can see all the people's suggestions um, on the screen, and it helps them out. Hell yeah. Game balance, um, fun things to add on, sound, graphics, gameplay, all that stuff. But all these games are really tight no, already. Really good. Everything's in good shape. And Yeah, these are all like 90, 95% level yeah. games. When you said like WP, you know, Working WIP, progress. I was like, oh, we'll see. Yeah. But no, no. this was like completed games. We played yeah. completed games that are in Free. worse shape than these. Oh. <laughs> so it's good oh, yeah. to see. These are top, top notch, 95%. They're just yeah. fixing tiny things. Game balance. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and honestly, I have to say, I think one of the, I think my, the game of the, uh, of the day Andrew was... is reusing large parts of Boulder Dash. That's why he reuses the same. So it would be a um, lot of work to re- map the game onto another um type of what is it Oops. called again memory yeah. mapping yeah uh bank switching bank switching that it is because the atari only can see so much memory on a yeah. cartridge so you have to flip between different sections of memory um so it, it'd be hard i'm guessing it's hard to remap them yeah. after i don't know anyway once you're committed you're fine and you know, he wants to put on a cartridge anyway, so why does he care yeah. about whether it runs on this or that? As long as the demo can run somewhere, it's fine enough to sell the final cartridge. Yeah, man. I think Dragon's Descent was the game of the day for me, but it's like, yeah. that, that's, like a, that's like a minimally well, that's, choice, you know? Like, it's hard. All the other games I were, like, know. so much, you know, everyone Chaotic was... Grill is such a good port. Chaotic Grill is a great game, too. And Daredevil is, is awesome. really, really good. Like, good, simple, solid concept. And I think and it's, like anything, it's also a genre, right? Like yeah, it's I, hard. I love that genre of... Each, each of those are such a different genre. That's yeah. what I think really made it good today. Daredevil's arcade-y. I'm, Definitely, but it's like a v avoidance. Daredevil thing. to me and Daredevil and Sokobo are like um, almost like iOS games, the kind of thing you would sort of play on your phone or something. Yeah, you know, because like you can puzzle, use, and then also like you could just it's imagine like a four playing. direction simple thing. Yeah, versus Chaotic Grill and Dragon's Descent felt more like um, this absolutely just needs to be on the Atari. You know, yeah. this wouldn't work on another. Well, actually, maybe like they might work. But, uh, you know, they involve a button. Yeah, exactly. And when you start getting into buttons on iOS or, or uh, phone games, then you 
you're like it's got two gets, hands uh, involved. You just it's you messy, just, you know. It gets messy. Um, yeah, Dragon's Descent probably. I mean, it's not a competition. No, that's but, just but a... because they're so different genres. Chaotic Grill is such a great game. Yeah, Chaotic Grill is amazing. And Sokobu is as far as puzzle games. It's yeah, it's right up there. Just because that's just, just the gra the graphics and audio that he's put into it and that's just my subjective yeah. opinion you know like it's not at all and in this case it's like all four of these games were terrific it's yeah. just if i if someone had made me pick i'd be like <laughs> dragon's descent that's good yeah. shit man it's definitely the mo one of the more challenging games we've played too you have another short break coming up not in a while but i just want to let you guys know yeah. the 18th uh will be i'll be off for a little bit um Erlen will be taking care of these kitties. I will. Oh, I'm away. No, don't chew. Yeah, pens. he loves pens. <laughs> I'm going to Portland and LA for more screenings of my film. So it's going to be two places that are so cool to go to. Oh, man. Portland's awesome. Both LA's awesome. awesome. Don't chew that. You'll break your teeth. Yeah. Um, um, so if anybody lives near LA or Portland, I'll be in those areas. Um, come out, see my movie, or yeah. not. <laughs> It's getting good reviews. Just won an award. So. Yeah, this guy won a huge award, man. It was best storytelling at the um, uh, Texas. Yeah, Women Texas Film Festival. Which is, uh, which is crazy because and most... I finally got my name on IMDb. Fuck yeah. Because not every film festival is IMDb qualifying. Really? Yeah, they are very selective. You can't just run a festival and say, oh yeah, I'm getting awards. They have to be around for a while. They have to serve more than the local area, too. Wow. They have to have invite uh, filmmakers from all over the world. Well, the cool thing so about... International film festivals, more like... The, well, the exciting thing about the Storytelling Award is that yeah. James's film was a documentary, and so it was actually... Mm. That was a competition not just in documentary category, but out of all fictional films. Yeah, that's amazing. And you would think that Best Storytelling wouldn't go to a documentary. <laughs> because um, you're shaping a story, but you're not creating a story. Totally. So yeah. that's just really great for everybody, man. Yeah, I talked about this last time. Oh, so. you did? Okay. Yeah, of course. I'm, I'm, of course I'm I was just... excited, right? <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. This is the first time I'm here. Yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah. So I want to thank everybody uh, who's watching live, who's watching later on Twitch, and who's watching later on YouTube. Hello, That's right. all YouTube people. 60 frames. Yep, 60 frames. Send it to 60 frames. Don't complain to me. I say it at the beginning of every show now, so yeah. hopefully that will stop. It's like, oh, wow. it's all weird looking... Hang but on. that's People also that's the always the streamer um uh you know like plague is there's going to be one question that everyone asks you know yeah guys sometimes like watch diablo 2 streams and there's like this like plugin which will let your stash get extended and so every uh, every time i click on like a random place someone's being like how do you have such a big stash and so there's <laughs> always this i think every streamer has one question that they like oh and, yeah and i think gets our, over and over and our question is always at 60 frames it's yeah always going to be the one it's because i I literally cannot set it to, I don't think I can set it to 30 and have no. it the same because then I'll look like all the other Atari 2600 streams and videos that look terrible. Yeah. And we don't want to look terrible. Like all jagged and terrible. Yeah. We so. want We want some beauty. People have complained. It's like, Oh, it's too much bandwidth. It, I can't run 60. It's like, no, I'm in the future. I'm looking to the future. You're I'm totally... not, I don't want to, you know, compromise the stream and honestly 60 has become the new standard for it gaming it's it, just it wasn't a year and a half ago when but, when i was starting to stream like some people didn't have tvs that did 60 yeah um progressive um but now everybody like almost all devices can do that so yeah i look to the future and stuck with it it's even good. though people are like blah blah, blah. and we're not going to need any more than that it's just no. per, it's a perceptual thing there's a point where well, like and also this only goes 60 yeah but i i actually yeah. think from just a like our eyes perceptual oh, level i hate 120 yeah it doesn't it's actually it's too much and it doesn't actually change it that much because no. there's only so many frames you can add before your brain just doesn't really like start to see anything new and it looks like an action film yeah, at that point, or like a a war film, or like a weird sporting event. Or yeah, something. that too. So thanks for hanging out with yeah. us, um, and we will see you on Friday. It's an evening show, so the later time. Look it up on uh, Atari Age forums for the times. Hell yeah! Um, Six p.m. Pacific time, nine p.m. Eastern time, two a.m. GMT. I think. You'd know better than me. I don't know that's or maybe that's it's good. Not. But you look it up on, on Atari Age forums. Thanks for hanging out with us and sticking with us for three hours. And we'll see you next time. Yeah, see you next on Wednesday. On Zero Page. Bye-bye. Bye. We love you. Bye. Bye. Bye, Lurker. S. Ramirez, 2008. Bye-bye. S. Ramirez.